Hey, oh, good evening, everyone. Um, thank you for Buenas joining us. Um, appreciate you participating in this Coming Highway Reconstruction and Design um, Public Meeting. Um, my name is Jeffrey Lexis, here with the Public Works and Engineering Division. I'm also served as the Project Manager of Design for the, um, the Cummins Highway Reconstruction Project. Um, joined here by um, Soy el Julia, director de Julia este Campbell, proyecto. our Deputy Chief of Streets. She's going to introduce y conmigo herself. está Julia Campbell. Hi, everybody. Hey. Um, thanks for the introduction, Directora Jeff. Directora asociada um, de Cash. I'm just here, but Buenas Jeff is running a show. Gracias por la introducción. Eh, estoy aquí, pero Jeff Thank es el Julia. que está amando esta noche. Gracias. Um, and also, you guys have met Hannah. Um, I'll let her introduce herself. Y también herself. han conocido a Hannah. Once again. Le voy a permitir que se introduzca. Hannah, you're muted. Hi everyone, my name is Hannah. I work Hola on the nombre, station team with BTD, and then I'm also joined by my colleague Activo Francis. Con el, eh, BTD. Y conmigo está mi colega Francis Oliveira. Buenas noches a todos, Francis Oliveira. Community engagement specialist. Con el gabinete de calles y soy la especialista de eh, alcance Thank público. All right. So tonight, um, we're, here, we're here to talk about um, the Cummins Highway project. Um, this is our final um, design project to give you an update on where we're at um, in regards to this project. Um, so today, we want to provide an overview of the project goals um, and a defined design. Um, I believe a lot of you have seen this already, but we want to kind of share this with you. Um, we want to share the general construction timeline. Um, essentially, you mean this process is going to take a couple of years, and we want to let everyone know um, what they should expect in regards to the construction. Como ya saben, and lastly, um, we want to share how you'll be able to sign up to receive construction updates um, during um, this process. Um, so, Cummins Highway, why are we re reconstructing Cummins Highway? Highway. Cummins Highway hasn't been um, reconstructed and updated since 1955 no se ha actualizado um, when streetcars ran along um, the roadway. Um, in order to make eh, more room for, for, for cars and to uh, allow vehicles or non-residents to pass quickly through Cummins Highway, what they did was reconstruct. Eh, vehículos y no residentes pudieran um, pasar, traffic, se reconstruyó now, um, la calle con cuatro um, which, vías, course, has, cuatro um, eh, carriles. Pero como of, of ya saben, um, eso ha eh, producido speeding. problemas en el corredor, um, so incluyendo what we heard about alta Cummins velocidad Highway, de vehículos. Entonces, um, ¿qué escuchamos de Cummins Highway? Highway? ¿Por qué se tuvo que service? actualizar? Um, But what we heard um, is that the, the, the street is, is people don't feel safe. They don't feel safe crossing the streets. They don't feel es que, safe walking eh, or biking no along the corridor. Um, the sidewalks are just prepared. Um, people can't eh, walk along the corridor without reparo. tripping, without stumbling their toes. La gente no puede um, on, on the streets, tropezarse, um, on the sidewalks, they have um, los dedos de los pies, lips and raised sidewalks. Of course, the road needs to be paved, repaved, alzadas, um, es, national grid um, has, been the, has been along the corridor making repairs to the infrastructure ahead of, of um, these improvements. But um, even so, as, I mean, the, the roadway needs to work, um, utility cuts, um, not only from, from national grid, no but also Boston Water and Sewer Commission. Um, sino también en and los uh, of course, we heard about the speed. You mean cars traveling, grid, um, eh, regularly passing along the corridor over 40, 40, over 40 miles de per hour. Um, I mean, people, cars coming onto the highway um, with, without paying attention. attention. We've heard about the crashes over the past couple Gente of weeks no um, at some of the intersections. Eh, choques, um, and the last thing that we kind of heard is that um, it's very dark along the corridor. Um, just the lighting is just not adequate. So this is something that we wanted to kind of take care of as part of this project. So, beginning of the spring, uh, we are looking Entonces, to completely rebuild Cummins Highway from the Wood Avenue Vamos at Harvest Street intersection uh, to Fairway Street. Um, we are proposing to um, repave this section approaching um, Mattapan Square Estamos, eh, River Street. Eh, River Street. However, um, the majority eh, of the construction Square we're looking at um, River Street. working with the Transportation Department Pero to make those improvements as part of the Mat Mattapan Square re um, project. Forman parte so, de, eh, in regards to la the investment uh, on Cummins Square. Highway, this is the first investment, a uh, large investment Entonces, that we're doing. En cuanto a la inversión um, en Cummins Highway, es la um, primera desde the, the 1955, the cuando se quitaron los tranvías. So in regards to um, this project and how en much this project este proyecto, has been budgeted for, um, this is a $32 million um, investment along this corridor. Um, we understood that this is a neighborhood that's been divested in the past. Um, there's a dólares. lot of issues that needs to be addressed in regards Entendemos to this corridor. Um, and the city es, is fully eh, committed 
Um, una zona que, project, um, que ha carecido de la atención que merece. Is, como parte de este proyecto, vamos a trabajar border, con los residentes del vecindario. We, we vamos street. a reparar las aceras, modernizar los semáforos. So what we're looking at for um, Cummins Highway um, um, is calle. essentially to provide a train line neighborhood. We understand that it's called the highway. It's not, it's not a highway, um, but uh, our, our, our intent is to make no it a, a street that is safe carretera. for families, um, to Queremos connect to residents, resident, to open spaces, para familias, um, and to make it easier for elders eh, across para the street. Que le la um, we want to provide a connection to, to I mean, the Franklin Park to, to the Ponsett Green Road. These are all acts of Franklin Park Zoo, public spaces that you mean people in this community should be able to access to wherever they are, wherever they are, in the neighborhood of Mattapan. So in order to, to develop this design, um, Para the public process that we este went diseño, through, um, ultimately we started um, in 2019. This project was initiated in 2019. En el um, we had three community meetings bueno, at the Mattahan Community Center. Um, tres April reuniones comunitarias en Mattahan um, Community Center en abril del 2019. Y en el último, en townhouse, eh, febrero del 2020. Um, también se hizo kind of, eh, um, meeting una reunión we tried to share, abierta, you know, puertas abiertas, donde compartimos nuestras ideas, lo que habíamos um, escuchado de la comunidad y cómo queríamos proceder. The city, um, and Pero entendemos que hubo una falta de confianza kind of entre la ciudad y like el eh, vecindario so we por eh, problemas que hubo anteriormente. Um, Entonces quisimos salir de la conversación where we eh, con un ultimately diseño, proposed a pilot in October of 2020, que, which was the first phase, y por último, uh, eh, to provide un a proof of concept de 2020, uh, to, to show that the design that was de developed through these para, eh, conversations, through the city's goals and ideals, que se hizo um, estas to, to meet con, the needs eh, of, of this neighborhood. Los objetivos de la ciudad. Um, Also, I mean, to address um, para, eh, the, some of the safety issues and speed issues that, kind of, that occurred um, during the pandemic, las, less people eh, were walking, less people were driving, which ultimately created a number eh, of speeding con, opportunities eh, along the corridor. Um, throughout this time, we, 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 um, my colleagues from BTD, as well as me a couple of times, we, was, we were out walking on Cummins Highway eh, to talk to people that actually eh, live on the street, who, who experienced the street, veces, um, who have ahí, to deal with pudimos, eh, um, the traffic la and, um, en esta calle, and some of the tráfico, issues in regards to the, to the infrastructure. Um, we had a number of um, pop-ups and tabling at the Mattapan's Farmer's Hicimos Market from varias reuniones, October 2020 eh, to um, the summer of 2023, um, just to kind of share information and provide updates as well as um, para proveer información y actualizaciones y así como responder a preguntas en cuanto al proyecto de Cummins Además de esto, como mencioné, por último estamos buscando reparar la It's not listed on here, but we did have a number of um, community conversations and virtual conversations um, where we eh, talked about um, este not only no se, the, the services that the city offers eh, um, and, and what we're trying to do, um, and it's, it was about sharing information with the community, ciudad, um, but in addition to that, it, it, we wanted to kind of pinpoint what we were looking to accomplish eso, as part of the Cummins Highway project. Cumplir, um, como parte de este one proyecto. of the first um, meetings that we had, um, I believe we en coordinated uh, with hicimos, Mattapan Food and Fitness, Pop Pathways, as well as uh, the Mattapan, Urban Outdoor Association, uh, to fitness. host a special tea talk um, with a gentleman named of, um, of Charles Era, Brown. Um, we had a number un, of panelists that kind eh, of talked about black mobility in the US. Una reunión tea talk. Um, Ultimately, um, from that meeting, we kind of jumped into these, de la this series of, of conversations where we talked Unidos. about heat resiliency um, and climate change. We talked about air quality and pollution, Hablamos land use, street lighting, eh, public health, stormwater, flooding, de la bus ridership, del aire, um, and how we can improve to um, the bus the, the de 30, los route, de los route 30, route 30 bus, um, street trees okay. along the corridor. Um, we had a conversation de about intersections de autobús, um, and, and los vehicle de la calle, flow um, and design of all eh, ages, which pretty much, you know, de vehículos, pretty much showed how we eh, make decisions in regards to las edades, um, design que for, cómo hacemos, a, for, cómo a street, for las intersections in a diseño, for a project. I mean, we're not just making this up, calle, we're not just working in a vacuum. We are looking at principles eh, and guidelines no in order to come eh, up with these, um, trabajamos, eh, these proposals. Por sí mismo, sino um, que we had a conversation about um, people with dis eh, disabilities de la um, as well as public art. And, uh, as I mentioned, una we all wanted to figure out eh, ways that we can um, incorporate all of these elements and make them a component in the Cummins Highway Reconstruction Project.
y hacerlo un componente del proyecto so de construcción there, de Carlos uh, Highway. We developed and moved de ahí, with, um, this design desarrollamos where we at y avanzamos un diseño donde buscamos uh, we, reducir we el número de carriles that, um, y la capacidad. Cummins Highway safer, con el entendimiento but then also, de las, um, al hacer un carril en cada vía, hacemos Cummins Highway más seguro. Um, so what you can see here, I mean, this is an updated Pero rendering from what we've shown que el tráfico in the past, pudiera fluir más um, which eficientemente. Much provides a little bit more detail uh, Acá of what este dibujo le da un poco más de detalle de lo que puede esperar uh, de Cummins Highway but, en el futuro. Um, no es el 100% close. Eh, As you can Verás, see here, oh, uh, one pero, lane of travel in this es, direction, es um, which makes the Como crosswalks acá, um, shorter and safer for people crossing. Um, ve que los cruces peatonales son más cortos para hacer que sea más seguro cruzar. Hemos agregado árboles en el corredor. Estamos proponiendo más de 100 árboles en todo el corredor que vamos a mantener. Además de todo, vamos a mantener los árboles que están ahora. Tal vez se tengan que cortar uno. New street lines eh, all los espacios the ecológicos verdes, eh, las nuevas lights. líneas we'll en todo el corredor, we'll lighting, um, not only for the street, but also los nuevos faroles que no solo iluminan uh, la calle, as well as sino que también a los ciclistas um, y a, the, a, a las aceras that, y los peatones, that they felt like it was dark, um, para abordar um, ese problema um, que expresó la comunidad parking, um, en cuanto a la oscuridad. Vamos a proveer ese sufrimiento por la curva, es algo que la comunidad pidió expresamente por todo el corredor, es a lo, eh, tener suficiente espacio. Here is another look corredor. at Cummins Highway at the intersection of Rockingham. Acá le um, as I mentioned, you have the Cummins dual Highway. Um, street lights for the roadways and for the sidewalks. En la intersección de Rockingham, como le mencioné, los new sidewalks all along the corridor. Las nuevas aceras um, en todo el corredor. We'll be paving the roadway. Um, it'll be Vamos a repavimentar la calzada para hacerla más lisa. Um, no lo que se ve en la actualidad. So race crosswalks, y the, estamos proponiendo nuevas cruces peatonales elevadas. Las will be raised. Um, so eh, los cruces van a ser along, elevados um, para que los peatonales que están uh, caminando por la calle um, van a estar level. So, you mean the cars en, una up en un nivel to, elevado. Um, I, not totally sure what the name los of the street, but ahí, on, on all the approaches will have to slow down in order to, to, to drive up and then over um, the crosswalk. So this, this is a, a traffic calling element that makes it safer for pedestrians to cross um, As I mentioned, we eh, were providing green spaces all, all, all along on the corridor. I mean, we we wanted to take a look at eh, proveer um, espacios verdes en todo el corredor. We were designing for resiliency um, and sustainability. It's a major component of this project. So we are looking at proposing green infrastructure Um, bios wells, Entonces um, proponemos eh, um, una infraestructura um, planting spaces um, eh, all on the corridor to resume eh, espacios para plantar por todo el corredor um, during storms. y para reducir las inundaciones. Um, Lastly, we want to talk about the roundabout. Um, this was the design element último, that we wanted to, to, to try to manage this Um, intersection Esto es un in elemento de diseño que se introdujo para uh, manejar la intersección, hacerla más segura, um, as well as hacerla más accesible um, para los peatones, know, los ciclistas, it's, it's así como los vehículos. Como todos saben, es muy difícil para que los vehículos puedan doblar um, en las calles so laterales. This, with this design, um, con este o con este diseño, es una rotunda, un travel lane que va around. Un solo um, carril de tráfico, to, un solo carril que tiene que eh, um, or if pasar por la rotunda. I mean, it, it's, it's, um, y se puede utilizar short, para cruzar, distance, para seguir derecho, para dar la vuelta, where the para cruzar en la intersección, I mean, 70, 80 feet, um, long. So, que that donde actualmente to, I mean, son unos 70-80 pies para cruzar. Eso significa que el peatón tiene que estar mucho tiempo en la calle en sí. Esto disminuye ese espacio haciéndolo más seguro cruzar. Y también más seguro para los coches en sí porque les... As I mentioned, resiliency and sustainability has been a major um, important Como component mencioné, of this project. Um, as part of this project, um, the residents requested that we take a look at the air quality Como along the border. Um, de este proyecto, los recientes nos pidieron design, que nos fijáramos um, en la calidad del aire del corredor. Design, install, um, Como parte del diseño eh, preliminar, um, instalamos ocho um, sensores um, en, en las eh, calles. Um, What we learned calle, was that the air quality um, along the corridor uh, was, was similar to I mean, Woods. Lo que other levels that we observed in Boston. Um, there was no discernible difference um, in, 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 in the air quality along Cummins Highway. No um, however, the air pollution was about 10% lower 
Um, in a man, embargo, and help avoid la, screaming, which is the urban eh, wild, so, I mean, which is to be understood. Um, but um, what we plan on doing, um, they were removed, I believe, as of um, January, February of this year. Lo que um, we are planning on um, reinstalling them once the construction is completed to see I mean, what effects that I mean, this design and the improvements that we've made not only um, in the infrastructure along the corridor, but also the green um, infrastructure eh, improvements um, will in have, if they will have an impact um, on the air quality as a whole. So that's something that we're, we're taking a look at. We're still si working through um, as of right now. If you, want, if you have any eh, more questions um, or concerns or just want to know if si more information about the air quality, please reach out to us and we'll get that information to you. O si necesita más información, um, se lo puedo in addition dar. to the Cummins Highway project, um, we're Además also looking at making um, some safety improvements um, in the También neighborhood. I mean, so the car mejorar, streets approaches, south side, north side, um, neighborhoods of Cummins Highway. Coche, um, we're adding speed norte, humps across Boston um, to Cummins Side Street. One of the, a, one of the issues that we heard about this project and during the pilot was that um, people using the side streets has cut through. We are looking at providing speed humps to ultimately slow down speeds on these residential streets. Um, and, Entonces, um, in addition to that, resaltos, um, which will slow speeds to 20, 20, 20, 25 miles per hour. Um, but in, in, in addition to that, um, Public Works Department, we are looking at, um, as part of our annual um, state of good repair, where we construction program to um, address some of the, the, the side streets that need attention. Um, there, are, there are a number of side streets on the north side, the south side of Cummins Highway that need um, Sidewalk Estamos repairs. You know, some of them don't have en, sidewalks. En some of them, the roadways are in good condition, so um, the ramps may not be um, no compliant. So we are looking at making no those improvements, cumplen. albeit El after the, the common Entonces, highway. Um, Fijándonos en esos, completed, eh, we'll need, we'll need en esas mejoras um, también. That, but, um, that Una vez cumplido we este proyecto, at, vamos a poder part, um, eh, darle kind of un presupuesto a este proyecto para continuar esa conversación con la comunidad. So in regards to construction, um, we're ready to start this spring. Um, I hope you guys are as happy as I am. Um, we're we're, we're finally primera, getting a shovel in the ground. Um, we're hoping to have uh, construction Vamos completed a, um, by the end of 2026. Um, so la tierra. The roadway completed, y esperamos tree terminar plantings, para el 2026. Um, con la new calle lights, completa, green infrastructure, con las de árboles, um, hopefully we have a nice luces, ribbon cutting. Uh, eh, can, la infraestructura um, ecológica but what we're looking at for hacer, eh, la during this time um, y que puedan, we're still working eh, on, on the actual start Pero en este times momento estamos the quarter, eh, fijándonos en la construcción start, course, y en ese calendario the, the traffic in the morning, peak traffic in the, y entendemos que en ese tráfico um, eh, punto peak hours, de la so mañana construction, um, at least being y de la tarde on a day -to -day eh, basis, en cuanto um, a la construcción vamos a fijarnos vamos a monitorearlo día por día y vamos a in a more accelerated manner, um, we, we know that we can use this construction de manera más um, for the past, you mean, four or five years with the utility um, improvements that are being done. So we're, we're looking at how we can make this, um, con esta make this less of a disruption for you años. in the long term. Y queremos, eh, um, if you have any questions and you want to be updated menos, eh, um, in regards to the Cummins posibles. Highway and the construction, um, here's the website here at boston.gov. Si necesita slash, actualizaciones um, en cuanto a la construcción um, de Cummins Highway en sí, acá le mostramos el sitio web um, donde puede inscribirse para recibirlas. Um, y también puede mandarnos un correo electrónico. So, if you want to learn more, Cummins Highway Entonces, Project si Info. Si quiere aprender más, acá websites. tiene um, el sitio web. Y el eh, correo electrónico, creo que alguien también lo va a introducir a la caja de chat. Thank you, Jeff. Ya um, se puede copiarlo. So, yeah, thank you Gracias, everyone Jeff. for joining. Um, Gracias I a did todos por unirse. That we have, um, si a quiero notar a number of people from across the streets cabinet here including gente um, del gabinete, my colleagues Norman and Tan who are part of the eh, construction colleagues Norman y Tan, management team um, que parte del maybe I'll let de, them eh, introduce themselves if they would like to que ellos se si oh, así lo good evening go ahead Norman you go first eh, Norman eh, tu primero Good evening, Norman Parks here, Chief Engineer for City of Boston Buenas Construction noches, Management. Park, um, soy el ingeniero principal de, de la ciudad de Boston project. y del eh, proyecto de construcción. Hi everyone, I'm Tan Pham. Hola a todos, I'm the engineer for the construction management section. Soy ingeniero and, uh, para la sección we'll de, uh, de la gerencia de construcción. 
y voy a ayudar um, a so we have a number of manejar estos proyectos de construcción de um, I also wanted to Entonces, con nosotros hay mucha gente que puede responder um, a sus preguntas. Meeting, eh, también quisiera reconocer a los oficiales electos en esta reunión. Well. Voy a permitir que ellos mismos se presenten. Um, great. Okay, so we. Con eso. So I know we have a couple questions in the chat. Um, sé que hay eh, un par de preguntas en la caja de chat. This will work out. If we have questions in the chat, we'll just alternate between um, si answering your questions and then also. Chat, vamos a alternar um, entre sus yes, preguntas you're orales welcome to raise your hand and then we'll meet you. Puede levantar um, so la mano. You're able to, y le permitiremos um, abrir su micrófono, activarlo, para que pueda hacer su pregunta oralmente. Um, so, first I'm going to, Primero, I see that Ruth George has veo que Ruth asked Georges a question, so I'm going to unmute ha hecho you. Una pregunta. Entonces, le voy a activar el micrófono. Thank you, Hannah, um, and gracias, thank you, Hannah. Jeff, for the updates. Y gracias, Jeff, por In las actualizaciones. meeting, en nuestra última reunión, hice algunas preguntas en cuanto a la señalización um, del proyecto highway, to raise por Long Cummings Highway for the residents para that, eh, alzar la visibilidad um, para los residentes. Pedestrians, and they may not live there, but they walk and drive Tal vez peatones que no viven por ahí, pero caminan por ahí o manejan por ahí. Be, um, señalización sized so that they are aware un tamaño razonable para que conozca la construcción que se está haciendo. Esas son las preguntas que hice la última vez, pero no veo la respuesta aquí. La segunda pregunta que hice tiene que ver con la rotunda y las preocupaciones para los que son nuevos en el área the need to have potentially trans, um, signage that directed individuals on how to properly utilize the roundabout. Those are just two questions. Both of them Para alertar a individuos cómo utilizar la rotunda. Esos son dos preguntas que tenemos en cuanto so a que aborda la seguridad. Kind of get some updates around both of those if possible. Y quisiera actualizaciones en cuanto a ello, por favor. Thank you, Ruth. Um, Gracias, Ruth. Question. Hannah, is it okay for me to stop, stop sharing? Is that fine? Eh, Hannah, pudiera, ¿puedo parar eh, la presentación? All right. Um, sí. Uh, thank you, Ruth, for your questions. Um, Gracias, Ruth, uh, yes, por sus preguntas. We, we are working um, with our design consultant as well as the transportation department um, in regards sí, to the site. estamos the trabajando con um, el consultor de diseño, así como um, el, el departamento de transporte, en cuanto a la señalización um, por el corredor. Eh, en la última reunión, una de las preguntas que se hizo fue de más señalización um, en la rotunda, like así como más señalización. Um, en la intersección uh, uh, to, del corredor. Just to clarify, are you referring to the, the, the RFB and the flashing lights? Is that what you're also referring to? ¿Se está refiriendo a las luces fine. intermitentes? Yeah, I that was also part of the sí, eso okay. también creo que eso um, también formó parte de la última so conversación. We, we got an answer for the RFBs, um, which is Entonces, essentially... Eh, recibimos um, respuesta para esas luces intermitentes. Es que um, design, en ese momento um, vamos a instalar el proyecto como se mostró aquí. Um, Vamos the corridor, a monitorear ultimately, el corredor, corridor porque al final muchas de las mejoras um, que estamos proponiendo en el corredor deberían de hacerlo más seguro. Y si hay problemas, project, eh, vamos a notarlos y vamos a estar evaluando el proyecto. Um, y si los residentes um, están notando problemas, um, es algo que um, definitivamente quisiéramos um, eh, volver a evaluar. Para este proyecto, una de las cosas principales que quisimos hacer es analizar y evaluar, sea calificativo o cualitativo. Para realmente evaluar el proceso de diseño y hacerlo lo mejor posible. Para poder hacer lo mejor posible. Al final lo que tenemos son mejoras que hagan el lugar más seguro. En cuanto a la señalización, y carteles traducidos, mi entendimiento es que estamos instalando 
um, traffic creo, signs creo that que mis are, colegas de BTD pudieran uh, eh, responder mejor to, MT, MUTCD, pero por lo um, que entiendo vamos a instalar señalización de acuerdo a las normas safety. y las um, eh, regulaciones not necessarily developing our own signs to, to post no estamos, um, eh, along the corridor, desarrollando but, nuestros um, In terms of, I mean, yielding for pedestrians, I mean, that, that is something that we are looking eh, at. Sino um, lo que in, se ha hecho anteriormente. Um, along the corridor, eh, en cuanto a permitir el paso a peatones, estamos fijándonos know, um, en dónde instalar la administración por el corredor para um, mejorar yeah, I, la seguridad I, I can, y así alertar a los peatones to, del um, espacio. Uh, no sé si hay algo people, más que podamos hacer roundabouts. en cuanto a instruir a la gente cómo utilizar una rotunda. So even if it's not the instruction, just the directional no signs on the roundabout for those eh, who sí, are bilingual. Eh, we have a large Haitian population in the community that lives here. We also eh, have a bilingüe. growing Latino population. And I know throughout the city, I've seen other parts eh, where some Haitiana, signs are translated. So I guess I'm trying to understand, especially for those who've never used it, if Entonces, there's an opportunity to just put a sign on the roadway that says "Respect the Haitian language in the roundabout, quisiera para la gente que nunca ha utilizado una rotunda, directing them in another language. Alguna um, civilización en su idioma I, para I poder dirigirlos. That we are in doing this, like some of the, as we're, I'm not concerned. I'd like to believe that as we're doing these updates, we're esto, taking into consideration No, perdón, no preocupada. Population. Pero si vamos a hacer actualizaciones, actualizaciones quisiera mantener yeah, en cuenta a la población um, Yes, we did sí, take no your concern at the last meeting and what we sí, can do is we can install la última um, reunión y lo que podemos hacer es instalar install corrugated cardboard posters on eh, um, de cartón. our street poles. These will be sort of temporary, El, eh, but we've installed them across the, the city whenever there's a new change to a traffic signal um, or street configuration. We can definitely put those up. Um, so yeah, I think that's all that I have to say. Yeah, thank you. 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 The comments and the concerns, and I apologize because I wasn't at that last meeting. But, um, one of the things that our team and, and Jeff and Industries Cabinet as a whole um, are trying to be very sensitive to the fact that a lot of our traffic control signs are written in English or they're text only. And that, honestly, even for someone who is English as a primary or first language, they are difficult to get the information quickly because you're trying to focus on driving your multi ton vehicle, right? So, um, the signs at the roundabout, there will be uh, several signs on all the approaches and inside the roundabout center that either communicate to folks to keep right or show a series of arrows for the circulation of the direction of the roundabout itself. So trying to make use, as you rightfully pointed out, um, whatever signs are available and, and allowed by law um, that communicate that information without using English words. Thank you. That is, that's really what I was, I was advocating for. I appreciate that, Claire. Gracias. Es realmente lo que estaba eh, es por eso que estaba abogando. Gracias. Gracias, Ana, um, so para identificar um, que se van a utilizar esos carteles. Here, we can reiterate to our, our eh, associate members that those signs are going to go up and, and eh, so that they can make sure 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 that con eso voy a pasar a una pregunta de la caja de chat. Se lo preguntó cuándo va a empezar la construcción o perdón dónde va a empezar la construcción. Norman puede proveernos información en cuanto a la administración de los planes de construcción. Yes, I'm sorry. Yes. So sí, we're perdón. looking at a block to start this. We already started this process now as far as doing some test pits. Ya empezamos uh, el proceso. Of course, utilities. Uh, having coordination with utilities as far as the work, work scope that we're doing here along Cummins Highway. Um, we're looking to somewhere around shovels in the ground. Estamos probably the, around the 14th, en, somewhere the second eh, week of April. Tierra, um, we're still eh, configuring that timeline um, as we go into the test pits. Test pits and working on it. Somewhere you see the middle of April, we'll be starting the process there. Starting coming from Wood Ave, working our way down to Fairway. Empezando en uh, el slow Burak, process hasta in the Fairway, uh, we're still coordinating with the utilities as far as lento, the methodology, eh, which we'll be using to, uh, to dis eh, las, disassemble the, las the de servicio again. en cuanto a la metodología. Yeah, and so we will definitely send out 
um, more y nosotros details también by vamos email a mandar más detalle por correo uh, electrónico okay. ni bien so I'm nos going tengamos. To go to Shikwana. Y con eso voy a pasar a Shikwana. I'm going to ask you to unmute. Ya Hi. puede activar su micrófono. Um, Hola, buenas tardes I... a todos. I've been I've lived here for like four years and um, aquí unos cuatro años. I was not aware of the entire thing, but so far um no I just have a few questions because in the four years I've lived here, here pero, I've seen the um pero tengo the design años, and um, años que he acá, he visto I have some questions. So the traffic, preguntas. they said that they're doing this to what to slow down traffic el or to improve traffic because. I live 15 minutes from um, Mattapan Square, and that's walking, and it takes me 20 minutes to drive down there es, y eso es with this, um, with toman, this eh, upcoming design. Also, um, I don't live everywhere else. Este I only live here, so I can only speak. Ah, además, I know no we're taking um, all this money and infrastructure with tax and everything to build um, bike lanes. Are we going to start um, charging By bicycle riders um excise tax as well because I to be honest I see more handicaps um I feel like the if those lanes were made for handicaps I would feel better because I see more handicapped people um in their scooters on the coming highway than I do see cyclists. Um, en sus, also, eh, instead of um, eh, diapositivos de eh, mobiliarios en vez de los ciclistas all those, some Entonces, of those stuff there um, the sleeping um, the sleeping homes would be better to slow down speeding because speeding what I've noticed mejor while living here speeding happens between a certain time of day it happens acá, really early eh, in the morning en, when there is less um, vehicles on eh, the road or probably be really late at night las horas matutinas cuando hay menos vehículos en la calle o muy tarde por la noche. Thank, thank you, Chiquana. Um, Gracias, right, I'm going to try to address um, Voy a your intentar abordar your comments. I, I did get um, a couple of them. Sus preguntas o comentarios. Um, and um, in regards to the traffic on Cummins Highway, um, en cuanto al tráfico yes, por Cummins Highway, we did an analysis um, along sí, the corridor in regards to the number of travel lanes. Por el corredor. Um, And, en cuanto al número um, de in carriles, to the capacity, Cummins Highway, y en cuanto a la capacidad, the engineer shows that it doesn't need four travel lanes. Y el internet um, we understand that there, que no there are concerns with traffic congestion on the quarter, um, which is one of the reasons why we wanted de to de tráfico um, por el corredor, the pilot, es uno which, de los, did, um, eh, which did show us that traffic could flow, um, and it could work. I mean, there were some issues, there were some concerns, um, mainly the, the median. The median had to go just in regards to Vehicles being able to pass, eh, emergency vehicles, reunión, um, though that did cause a concern during the pilot, um, which we did um, pasar, analyze and use the information from to, to improve on this design. Um, y, eh, in regards to, tomamos, eh, I mean, driving into Mattapan Square, yeah, absolutely correct. Um, the Mattapan Square intersection pretty much Square, creates a block usted, um, eh, along Cummins Mattapan Highway, Square, on Blue Hill Ave, as well eh, as River Street, eh, um, which is why the transportation department is looking at providing Um, es por eso que el departamento de transporte busca well mejorar esa intersección así como eh, mejorar la señalización de tráfico una cosa que hemos hecho es eh, agregar una capa más para Cummins Highway para permitir que el tráfico pueda fluir más como parte de este proyecto y mientras que proponemos reducir el número de carriles en el corredor de Howling Street a Madapan Square vamos a mantener los carriles For the exact reason that you mentioned, like the, the, the traffic and the need to flow, so we have to provide that capacity. Um, but um, what, as you mentioned, all, like, on other days, mencionó, other times during the day, There is, there is otros, ample opportunity eh, for, otro, for every driver to speed on Cummins día, Highway. There's a number of crashes on, along the corner. Los, um, not just eh, people getting hit, but also eh, other vehicles getting hit, puedan, eh, um, as well as um, property velocidad. damage. Um, there's, there's crashes that, that no don't get reported vehicles, to EMS, to the BPD, I mean, because I mean, no one was injured. Um, so this, this is exactly what we're trying to tackle as part of this project, in addition to making the road safer for all modes of traffic, not just cars, Entonces queremos hacer esta calle well as, más segura, um, no we, solo para los vehículos, sino también para los peatones y los ciclistas. Um, Tenemos el more, espacio um, y lo more... queremos proveer. Safer and, and better accommodations for the mean, people who are handicapped eh, or disabled más um, to, to walk along this corridor. So, seguro, I mean, eh, we wanted to take a look at all users as part of this project. Para la gente um, and, and traffic was definitely one of them, and that's something that we, we would continue to address. Um, y el tráfico, definitivamente, fue parte de esta conversación. 
which is, I mean, how we, we, we tend, tend to look at I mean, providing or maintaining track flume on the quarter. Entonces, um, es por eso que vamos a mantener el, I believe that was tráfico en el corredor. That was just one. Um, yeah, because I was sí, asking also about the, bi the bike lane. So we live in, we live in Boston de, and I, we live in Massachusetts en Boston, and we have en warm times not so frequently. This is like one of y the no rare years eh, where um, eh, un clima we have such a nice weather. Esto es uno, uno and de años raros throughout the year, you probably see one, maybe two cyclists eh, on the, on the street. And um, we are taking up an entire section of street. As I said, if it was being used for handicaps, I would feel better because I do see a lot more people in scooters um, going about their business than um, than I do see bikes than I do see people on bikes. Um, and I don't, and I feel like that is not being mentioned at all. Um, also, um, for the for the for the bus. Um, y también para there's los nothing buses. being done pertaining to the MBTA for the no people in the community because it takes 30 minutes para for, la one, la for one bus to arrive and just imagine you're paying your tax Entonces, you're paying for this ride and you're spent, you have to wait 30 minutes para, for the same eh, ride like, these, are, these are some of the issues that I feel like that's not being addressed concerning the development. Like everyone is taking the money to and doing all these stuff and nobody's este addressing what um what the eh, people in the community is todos, really, eh, that's really affecting dinero, them. Esas cosas. Okay, thank Pero you, thank you. All right, so I'll, I'll address the bikes. Um, sí, ultimately, as I mentioned, like we're, we're, we're reducing the number of travel lanes on Cummins Highway. It's not for a bike project. Vamos a um, we're, we're ultimately eh, looking at los um, making this roadway Cummins safer. Highway, pero I mean, no es safety is, is, is the, the, the major goal of this la project because of the number of crashes along the corridor, because of the number of people who have been injured along this corridor. We have the space to allocate to the bike lanes. Para, I mean, eh, of course, I mean, you, you may not see a lot of people biking on Cummins claro, Highway because um, no personally, I don't feel like it's safety. Um, I've, I've, rode, I've, rode, no I've rode my bike on Cummins Highway uh, before the pilot, during the pilot. Um, eh, I mean, there was a gentleman who was killed piloto, riding his bike on Cummins Highway. Piloto, um, it, it's, eh, as it currently stands right que, now, it's not a, a safe, eh, in my opinion, a safe road to ride your bike on because of the speeding. Um, what, what, we, what we're ultimately no es you know, aiming to do is make por it safer for people who, who want to bike. Al al cabo, and of course, I mean, with, with, with the weather that's changing, the weather that's improving, it's going to provide access to you know, the Ponte Roadway. It's going to provide access to the Franklin Park and those bike lanes that will be built in those areas. Um, ultimately, the intent is to I mean, provide these accommodations for the people who actually live here who want to ride their bikes. I mean, I've, I've been out on Cummins Highway and seen a bunch of kids riding their bikes on the side streets. I mean, it would be great if they'd be able to ride their bikes uh, on Cummins Highway in a safe space. Um, you know, we we'll have to worry about cars or pedestrians. Bueno um, so that's ultimately what we're looking at. We're looking at providing accommodations for all, coches, for all users, for all users you know, to, to get around Boston. Boston. And that's, that's ultimately what it is. And, and, and we're looking at providing uh, those accommodations uh, as part of this Boston. project. Um, in regards to the MBTA, um, I hear you. Um, we know that the headway is on the, the 30 bus or around 20 to 30 minutes um, during the day. Um, it may be longer in some of the, the, the peak hours. Um, as part of this project, we are proposing um, better, better infrastructure for, for the MBTA bus stops. Um, we, we, are, we were looking at providing um, additional shelters along the border, which we are trying, still trying to do. Um, that's still a conversation with the MBTA we're trying to have, like, even like the EX signs that kind of... You have real time Estamos displays about what time, what time the buses are coming. MTA Those are all things that we are still trying to aim to do, and, and, and MBTA does have some pilots. Para um, darle and, and we did request for, for some of those cuando, cuando some shelters to be, to be installed on Cummins Highway. So we're still working through that. Um, we'll Entonces, have the space eh, along Cummins Highway. We are providing ADA-compliant um, bus stops in regards to their guidelines eh, as of today. Um, so that, that, that is another normas. improvement that we are. We, we have made it um, substantial improvements de, de in regards to this design um, for Hemos the MBTA bus stops. But like, as I mentioned, like, we will eh, continue to, to, to try to do more en um, as part of this project even after it's Pero como mencioné, eh, se va, eso se va a ver aún cuando eh, termine el proyecto. Um, thank you. I'm going to move on to Ruby. Gracias. Voy a pasar Thank you, Hannah. A... Hi, everyone. Ruti. I'm Whitney Salaston. 
I'm your format of liaison. Mi nombre Eric, es Whitney Don, Celestin. And Eric took over. Eh, so eh, and I do want to thank um, all our engineers, engineers, all the BTV team for all their work Eric. on this project. We definitely want to see a todos los um, a todos los better things come to the neighborhood. My trabajo. question is around um, eh, the section that you shared around the Sonoco. We shared around 651 and I'm going to put in the chat so everyone can take a look at it. So when you open up that image, you see that for me, in my opinion, it's a little slim. And what I'm thinking about is the fact that the Matterhorn School is up the, up the street. It also hosts a Tucson Valle Cultural Center. As you know, um, enrollment is going up at that school. That's um, a Haitian Creole bilingual school, the first one in the city of Boston. And so with a larger Haitian population coming on, right, there are going to be more school buses, more cars dropping off kids. Entonces, I've been asking this question since this project started and in the February meeting. And again, we want to put all our trust into our engineers and their assessments. So my question is around, um, what was the assessment like around the width of this entry for this roundabout or any other ones along the way? Because I'm concerned about la, eh, the width and school buses using it. School buses are not always small. There are larger school buses. Porque and also thinking about how the hump will affect that. Like, what was your assessment like around this area, this area, around this area um, considering these features um, and the fact that eh, large, area, not just school buses, large trucks also travel eh, that road a lot. Eh, so, thanks for any feedback. Thank you, Rudy. Thank you, Rudy. Thank you, Rudy. So, yeah, so in, in regards to um, the, the travel lanes along the corridor, um, sí. they're, they're 11 feet wide. Um, they're, I mean, standard um, width for, 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 for roadways, um, for, for travel lanes along the corridor, uh, throughout the city of Boston. Um, we've honestly have gone down to, I mean, 10 feet wide. Um, the MBTA buses, they want, they want at least 10 and a half. Um, so buses, eh, school buses will have no issues in traveling along the highway in regards to the level of the wide um, no traveling that we are providing for this highway. project. Around the, round the roundabout, um, the roundabout, the travel ancho. lane for the roundabout, technically, rotunda, um, the space that's available is 15 feet wide. Disponible, um, in addition to that, este um, the roundabout Además is actually eso, mountable. Um, la rotunda es because of the Sonoco gas station and because of their um, their operations in terms of their, 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 their tankers, um, y sus we had to provide uh, y los a mountable roundabout eh, in order for them to be able to make this intersection in a safe manner that we can transit in a manner that other approaching traffic. So, no um, yes, absolutely, that's something that we looked at. Um, we did have conversations with the gas um, but in terms of the, 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 the roadway widths, um, as I mentioned, like we're going from a four tanto, lane to a two lane, so we, we, we definitely have enough calle, um, space to accommodate a, a um, proper de and appropriate um, travel lanes um, along the corridor. Thank you. Thank Gracias. you. Um, Next up, we have Mr. Vicky. Yes, good evening, everyone. Um, Buenas noches a todos. I am, first off, I'm Vicky Siggers. Um, Mi nombre es Vicky Siggers. Part of Matapan Food and Fitness slash Matapan Food, oh, Matic food Access and Fitness Manager slash e Matapan Fitness Market Food Manager. Access Manager. And because y we're at the um, parking lot, city parking lot number y um, 14, el, lo which de faces de la ciudad, Commons 14, Highway, what I'm asking is highway. if you can please let us know Quisimos and share si por favor with me dejar saber or share with all of us how we todos. can navigate to make sure that um, our customers and guests para asegurarnos que nuestros clientes, nuestros huéspedes, que puedan, que, que vienen al Farmer's Market, Where que puedan llegar de una manera segura. Cummings and Fairway. Can you let, ¿Dónde can estamos you en Cummings me and Fairway? Where you're going to start ¿Me puede decir dónde va a empezar la construcción? That's my yes. first. Esa es mi primera pregunta. Please, please, please proceed. Yes. Listen. Do you, want, do you want me to answer? No. 
puede poseer Please, o que quiere que yes, le pregunte. Yes, I'll answer. Uh, thank, perdón, thank, thank you, Vicky. Oh, sí, gracias, definitely, you're on our contact list. You're on our agenda. Sí, usted está en nuestra uh, lista de contactos y en nuestra agenda. Uh, We Estamos are, eh, trabajando you en, you met, en ese um, proceso Tan eh, preconceptivo. Earlier, um, as part of this meeting. Um, Tan Cuando eh, nos reunimos con usted, con Tan y Norman, como parte de esta reunión, um, um, Tan, que es el ingeniero residente, um, eh, trabajando en el campo en este proyecto, um, trabajando con el contratista. Farmers Market, absolutely. Eh, um, we, en cuanto al all, Farmers Market contractors de Marapian, absolutamente. Todos um, nuestros contratistas, not, or, or, as part of their, their construction, are supposed to como maintain access to parte any of the businesses de su construcción deben mantener acceso a todo comercio. En in, in regards to construction, it is disruptive. En cuanto a la construcción, um, sí, es disruptivo. Y entendemos que va a... A impactar and, and las esferas. Like um, um, eh, um, pero voy a pensar en que time el equipo them, like, de, de decisión de construcción también agrega algo que si Monday quieren. Friday, sé que um, eh, por mi parte lo que entiendo la construcción se va a hacer generalmente el lunes a viernes. Open. Um, y en, term, not, not intentan no dejar las aceras um, abiertas. Access, but, um, no en cuanto a abiertas para acceso, sino en un estado donde no hay concreto. Um, generally, la acera es inaccesible generalmente cuando están reconstruyendo la acera intentan hacer el reparo antes del fin de semana para no tener que cerrar la acera por, la, eh, por el fin de semana um, allow, you mean, access eh, and, al fin y al cabo to, I, I lo que queremos es mantener el acceso highway, para permitir que la gente pueda Um, to have Caminar a conversation to let you know when construction is going to start, market. when it's going to be in your area. Eh, pero deben, um, deberían de alcanzarle de ponerse en contacto con usted cuando va a empezar la construcción updates, en su área. Y como um, le mencioné, they, they hay un enlace um, donde puede inscribirse para recibir actualizaciones. Pero sí, deben de contarse con usted específicamente para conversar acerca de esto. Y Um, Tan, Tan, or Norman, did you guys want to add anything? Uh, Hi, Vicky. I'm Tan. Tan I'll be the engineer for that project. Hola, Vicky. Mi nombre es Tan. Um, Soy el ingeniero de este proyecto. I will surely let you, uh, you know, get you posted and uh, keep you updated. Por seguro le voy a mantener al tanto. Um, I'll be on site almost every day. En cuanto al proyecto. Uh, if you have Estoy any concern, en el campo casi, out, en el sitio casi todos los días. Or, or look for, even si tiene alguna preocupación, no puede enviarme. If, if you have any concern, que va a you can con let usted. me know if the contract not si working on, you know, not doing what they're supposed si to do. And uh, we'll, we'll do everything we can to uh, make sure hacer. you get in and out of the parking lot. Vamos a hacer todo lo posible para que usted pueda uh, entrar y salir de ese lote de estacionamiento. The farmers market, the Madison Square the farmers market. Sí. Opens el eh, farmers market de Madison Square abre el 13 de julio. Guys are going to be starting. Whoever sé que van a empezar en abril. That's fine. Eso está bien. I just need to make sure that I'm in Solo quiero asegurarme with others so that we are uh, making sure that everything that we need to bring for para asegurarme our affordable, que uh, todos grown food, tengamos lo que necesitamos para poder eh, traer nuestra comida eh, que es asequible y eh, crecida localmente con todos sus together. servicios y programas al público, todo lo que estamos planeando yes, para que pueda absolutely. hacerse and, and our, um, our team, absolutamente y nuestro equipo de alcance um, va a conectarla al equipo administrativo um, para on que le puedan dar esa información para um, que puedan notificarle the antes de tiempo you're, 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 on, you're on our list, we got you. Entonces, usted está en nuestra lista, no se preocupe. Let me add to that. If I may, good evening again. Um, si pudiera, yes, we're, we're, planning, we're definitely working with all, sí, all, the, all of the um, business owners there along the corridor of Blue Hill, of um, Dry eh, Cummins Highway. Um, we've already started talking with um, David's Funeral Home, um, ya the, the local business of the gas stations. Um, con el, uh, eh, we've, we've also talked, spoken with, um, with the other funeral homes, the Shields, but now it's Lopes. Lopes, uh, Lopes, eh, Lopes, Lopes, lo que and antes that, era Shield. You know, we're working along with them as far as uh, as he gets services there ellos. and how that's going to be difficult on en his business because it's always been small along that area of Hollingsworth and Cummins Highway. Um, and definitely we can, um, we will, we're working along with, with the uh, the, the Farmers Market, the store, 
they have um, con, eh, working eh, along. Keep in mind, we're not the last pilot project we're going to do. Pero would, tengan would be cuenta, the la última parte de este proyecto redoing the roadway from River Street to Fairway. So that corridor will, will be accessible um, with, with no, no restrictions of any type of construction going on there for the for the beginning. No, um, será so yes, we'll, we'll definitely keep all, all those things in mind, along with the residents there and how Entonces, it would affect um, the contractor is sympathetic to the whole bit. Um, he was on a walkthrough there two weeks ago. Um, he's eh, a very good uh, contractor in the court that's doing the work along there. So, um, eh, and McCoy, I'm going to be out there along with a lot of the engineers can, and my associate, Bob Estrella, will be out there to make sure this uh, project goes along as smooth as possible um, and working along with the residents there. Este and, of course, the liaison to community engagement. There is a um, owner's, you know, business, local business meeting. I would like for you to allow matter of pan food and fitness to eh, be a part of that because the farmers market is que Marapan food and fitness y el Marapan farmers market forme and parte, it is a forme place parte de eso porque es un comercio um, en sí es un lugar donde la gente se reúne so, para conseguir eh, comida que se eh, crece localmente y otros recursos Entonces, por favor le pido que nos incluya Thank you, Ricky. Absolutely. Yes. Gracias, Ricky. Absolutamente. Um, Gracias. I'm going to call on Ihoma. Sorry if I mispronounce your name. Um, it's, I just it's okay. Ihoma. 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 Thank yep, you. No problem. Ihoma. Hi. So Ihoma. I am a Cummins si Highway resident. I've been on Cummins Highway for about 19 years. Yo soy buenas noches. Soy residente de Cummins Highway. Lo he sido por 19 años. And I know when I remember when they began doing the analysis on Cummins Highway in 2020. And my first thoughts was like, well, you're not really getting the proper analysis of coming to Highway and because it's a pandemic. Nobody's on the road. No There's no buses. Tienen, no and so you say that we don't need the four lanes, but if we do see in the morning, there are parents lined up on coming to Highway, so the other lanes are getting used by drivers that are going to work. Highway. So I don't know if we thought that through, but we think about the bus drivers. I think we brought up about the buses and parents parking. So that's something to consider. So that's something to consider. And parents parking. So that's something to consider. Con los I don't know if we took sus, that into eh, consideration. Like, I know there are parking no spots, si but remember now they're, they're building all these eh, new buildings around Cummins eh, Highway, so these parking eh, spots are going to be taken up so para by residents that live in the area on you know, Cummins si Highway, and then you have additional people that's going to be coming in the morning now to park to wait for these buses to come, and these buses are going to be pulled over. These kids take forever si to get on the bus, so that's going to be more traffic. Que tiene just things que to just consider when we're thinking about gente, just our two lanes. Lanes. Another thing I wanted to mention was, Entonces, no we said we did our analysis. I know you guys looked at Greenfield and Cummins mencionar. Highway and called that a high traffic, high crash highway. area. I don't know, a safety risk, but by my choque. house, which is, in, which is a part of your design there, part of your, when you show your picture, that's where all the crashes happen. The last time you guys spoke to Madam Pan, I said this on the meeting. Right after that meeting, there were seven crashes right in the same spot that I told you guys crashes happened. You were not going to see that on your analysis because you did it in 2020 when there was hardly no traffic. There was nobody really riding no on the road, but even during COVID, 20, there, there was still no some traffic, time, traffic happening here. No so no I calle. just have concerns Aún about that COVID. particular area, and I know you say, Entonces, oh, we're raising the road. Cars stop. It's particular. not like cars are just going straight through four ways. It, they stop. Y las, los coches day, paran. No es que simplemente sigan. I see miss crashes every single day. Que, and I'm eh, I do the analysis. I, I live para, right on Cummins Highway and I, in my, in my office is on the third días. floor. So I can look on Cummins Vivo Highway every day. Piso. I see near miss crashes eh, every day. So these are things that I don't think is being y considered. Y so when I say, you said you came to the community, I was walking the whole of 2020. I worked at Mattapan Community Health Center. So I walked Cummins Highway. Nobody ever asked me how I felt. Like, what is your concern? And I would have told you the crashes that happened. I had cars crash into my house. Y nunca this is why I'm so passionate about the crashes that happened on Cummins Highway. And that is casa. really my concern es por eso me about the safety of the elders. I've lived here for 30 highway. years, so I've known a lot of people that live in this community. I have a lot of my friends, their parents still live here. They walk to this community. Community. Like, gas station every day to go play their numbers. I worry about people like her. her. Y que caminan so hasta somebody, la estación de servicio. Just the other day, they were on Cummins Highway, they were on the sidewalk. Eh, 
la lotería. Ahora tenemos a los peatones por los cuales preocuparnos y también vamos a tener que preocuparnos so I'm, I'm por los eh, ciclistas, la gente en su coche que te, 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 por los cuales tenemos que preocupar. Entonces quiero otra vez presentarles esta preocupación en cuanto a esta consideración. Es una Washington Street and Fuller Street. There was an intersection. Four way. There was a 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 de en ello de esa manera es un área de una intersección de cuatro vías thank, thank you muy um, eh, yeah, I, I mean, it, gracias por su comentario I mean, the, the intent of this, pro this project is to improve safety um, Entonces, and, eh, and la meta de este proyecto um, el objetivo es I mejorar la seguridad en cuanto al análisis de tráfico um, este proyecto empezó en 2018 el análisis de tráfico que hicimos en Cummins Highway se basó, traffic se basó en los números del 2018, cuando el tráfico um, era mucho más alto so que durante, that no, mucho más alto que durante la pandemia. Utilizamos el análisis de esos datos um, para diseñar a Cummings Highway en cuanto al número de carriles de viaje um, so que se requieren. In terms of, you mean COVID? Yes, we took, we, we, we did COVID, look at the traffic and analysis, I mean, and, and, and we did do eh, traffic, I mean, traffic studies along the corridor during COVID. Y, um, eh, we, we've done a significant amount of, of, of traffic COVID. collection along Cummins Pero, Highway eh, as part of the pilot. After the pilot, um, how about crashes? Eh, though? How about the number of crashes on Cummins Highway? Because if you said you started in 2018, the crashes I started Porque counting si the number of crashes in 2017. When the first crash was in my house, So when the first yeah. car crashed, I'm like, what's happening on Cummins Highway? And so there have probably been a significant, there was a significant amount of accidents between 2017 and 2020. So, yeah, so, yeah, no, we, we, we understand. I, I, I completely sí, understand. Like, I, I, I grew up in Mattapan. I grew up in Mattapan. Um, I had a friend of mine who actually Mattapan. lived on Cummins Highway as well. So eh, like, I, I'm familiar with the neighborhood, I'm familiar with the crashes, Entonces, I'm familiar eh, with the speed and all of the corridor. Conozco, um, I'm feel, eh, familiar with just the, 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 the traffic um, on, a, on a daily basis, on the weekends, during the weekdays. Um, eh, conozco también el so like, tráfico I, 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 I understand. I mean, and, and that's semana, one of the things that we're looking at. I mean, that's why we, Entonces, that's why we, we, just, we es decided algo to go with este one of those directions because ultimately that's going to do is slow down the, the cars that are actually traveling on Cummins Highway. I mean, crashes don't just happen. I mean, like, 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 we've gone away from calling crashes accidents because si they're not accidents. There, there, there are things that are actually being done that that pretty much give drivers that 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 increases para que the, los conductores the, the um, or the likelihood eh, that a, a, a driver is going to crash. Um, so eh, that's what we're trying to remove as part of the project. Lo que queremos es disminuir la posibilidad para que haya un choque. If cars aren't driving as fast as they used to on Cummins Highway, I mean, there, there are going to be si less crashes no for cars that are, are coming out of the side streets. Because the side streets, I, think, I believe you're talking about Savannah and Rugby, which has been on our radar for years. We've had the property owner ask us to put a guardrail at that location. I'm talking about that property. That's the property I'm talking about. Completely understood. Completely understood. Um, what, what I'm trying to express is that the race crossings eh, that we are proposing, sí, all the approaches, ultimately cars are going to have to sí. slow down eh, al fin y al cabo, when entering and exiting tiene que off es que of the approaches, off the side streets. Eh, If they don't, they're going to damage their vehicles. Like, it's not, it's not, si it's not, no it's not hacen, a comfortable ride to have to ride up a, and then kind of ride straight for about 10 feet and then kind of ride down. If you're o, speeding no around, if you're speeding si over that hump to get onto Cummins Highway, which is now a one-lane roadway, para, eh, it, if, if, if someone's doing that, then I mean, that's, that's, not, that's out of our control. But in terms of the engineering eh, design si and how eh, we're looking to slow lado, vehicles down, down es this, is, this is the right way to do it. To, Pero to como ingenieros, esa es la mejor manera para disminuir um, la velocidad de los vehículos, para mantener el tráfico, pero disminuyendo la velocidad en el corredor. Like, Definitely the peak hours, you know, eh, there's cars on Durante on muchas lanes, horas y definitivamente las horas pico, Square. Hay, But eh, ideally, for the, coches, most of the eh, for the most of the, 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 the time, I mean, you have cars that are Pero driving la you mean, del día, one behind the other. You mean, along the corner on both sides. So in those two lanes, lanes, you'll have one car behind the other. They're driving at whatever speed they want to drive. But I mean, you y rarely see on Cummins Highway, unless it's during the peak hours where their cars side by side driving down Cummins Highway. 
Um, so that, that's Pero, what we're, eh, we're looking at. Que vemos, we know eh, that no outside of those peak hours, hours people are speeding. People are driving 40 miles an hour, 50 miles an esas hour. Horas, it's, it's very easy to, to get 40, into a crash. You mean, if a car is entering and you're not a man of, pain, of, 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 of Cummins Highway, if you're driving 50 miles an hour, um, it's, 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 a, 50 miles it's a recipe for, for crashes. So, I mean, that's es, something that we're trying to reduce along this quarter because we know that we know the crashes happen. I mean, we hear about them all the time. We know those are hitting a hit the other day uh, at, at Brockton and Bismarck. Um, so like that's ultimately what we're trying to prevent as, as part of these designs. Like we, we have to design our roadways to improve safety. Um, and that, in, in, in order to improve safety, you have to slow cars down. So that's, that's what, um, reducing the number of travel lines is, 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 um, is meant to um, accomplish. I think for the stop sign there too, get on Cummins Highway, because you got to, I'm telling you, even with the single lane, people are going to still see. Igual, that's just my, poner, uh, my opinion eh, on it. I see it happen eh, on Washington para, Street. I don't know why it wouldn't highway. happen on Cummins Highway. But, I mean, okay. Come, well, be, see, so that's, no, no we looked at we looked at everything. We looked at we looked at. Um, there's there's certain type of traffic calming elements or uh, measures that we can use on the street. Like Cummins Cummins highway. Highway. Cummins highway. It's, 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 a, it's an arterial. Um, I mean, there, there, are, there are a number of, of traffic elements that are not appropriate for coming to highway. One of the, one of the issues, or one of the requests that we've gotten throughout this process was speed humps. We can't propose speed humps on coming highway because of the classification of roadway that it is. I mean, you have emergency vehicles using the roadway. Um, if you have a, a fire truck or ambulance who needs to get through, I mean, ideally they're going to be using the highway. I mean, they can't hit a speed bump every 250 feet. So like, like, so no that, estar ideally, cada we're, we're looking at this design to Entonces, still maintain a fully functioning, este fully traffic flowing Cummins Highway, but just at a slower speed. That's the intent of the project. Thank, thank you. Gracias. Have the next question. Yeah. Um, Joanne. Joanne. Hi. Good evening. Um, I'm Joanne, and um, I'm also co-chair of the Cummins Highway Neighborhood Association. been living here for about for a over 30 years uh, now. Cummins Highway Neighborhood uh, Association. Highway. Um, I agree with a lot of what the callers are saying, but I'm not sure if there's so time to change con, much. Eh, lo que I would suggest that maybe no sé si the rugby in Savannah added a stop sign or maybe another set of lights. Pero en rugby um, Savannah, the si first set of lights... Agregar, on Cummins Highway is actually Wait, the ex exit of my street, which is Rockdale. Then you have where the blue line commuter, in, purple line commuter rail Cummins is. Highway, and then there's not another light Rockdale. until you get to Itasca. Tiene, eh, um, so maybe that's a suggestion azul, for eh, adding another morada, set of light. Um, otro se I too en think Itasca. that maybe it's eh, pointless quisiera, now, but the eh, assessment started in 2019. Otro Everybody was semáforo. home. That's pretty much. I traveled and walked the streets and ran every morning. And never really saw this, you know, anyone approaching me Yo, to discuss eh, what they, you know, what we mucho think of this uh, new plans. It's desperately needed. The roads are horrible. They're dangerous eh, as is without that eh, right now. There are a lot of kids that travel. There are a lot of buses. Um, I did hear on the call that, which I didn't pick up at the last meeting, the two-way eh, is going to be back into effect from Lopez Funeral eh, Home. Is that correct? And just a one lane from that point on to Woodrow. Eh, I just want to confirm días, if that's the case. Días, um, en, eh, also, la casa eso es I, I may have missed this, but uh, en eso caso, what's en ese the exact caso, location that the si construction is going to be started? No that way we can pass on to all the residents, um, you know, residents, and given this is starting in April, vecindario. I personally think there should be already signage, en abril, digital signage, creo que ya probably de placed in two locations, digital. maybe at the commuter rail o stop, and then at Woodrow, vez en la parada let in del, the neighbors know and the, 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 the drivers who actually go through this area in hundreds Woodrow. of cars every day that Donde destruction is starting de with a digital eh, signage stating the date of eh, when the construction eh, begins. Podrían poner señalización digital para mostrar en qué fecha va a empezar la construcción. Yes, thank, I can, thank you. Thank you. I can take that last question real quick and that we will be adding eh, um, signs pregunta, along vamos the corridor. A agregar 
Um, Se hizo ya por el corredor driving, para que la gente caminando por la calle manejando pueda aprender acerca del proyecto well. y va a tener el sitio web y los de contacto en esa señal y eso va a ser cuando la construcción o la construcción ya empiece creo que se debería hacer inmediatamente porque abril está por venir Sí, absolutamente. Okay, and then I'm not sure if I missed this one. Possible. What what lane are you starting on both lanes? Which side is the construction plan? Do you no plan to start construction? And I know it's hard to get equipment off the road, but again, some the someone else had this question: Is this going to be on the weekends, which gets busier? Um, equipment's going to be left all along the road. It's going to be a project. Although I know it's needed, I just want to have everyone. Pero sé que es necesario, pero no queremos que se tome más de los residentes a diario y que no podamos transitar por la calle. En cuanto al equipo en la calle, el contratista está invertiendo su tiempo en la comunidad. Él está tomando residentes en la comunidad de Tampa Street por Seminole. Um, as far as looking, un, looking for sites there, off of the highway to be able to bring this equipment to, to uh, as we call it, a laid-out spot. Uh, that's out of the way. That takes that, that's going to take away from any type of um, um, congestion on, on Cummins Highway. Um, we're working along with, we're trying to work along with uh, the utility companies Estamos as we stand right now, we said, for a start date of April, the middle of April. We're still working with Through some para coordination with some utilities on, on the process there, so we, so we can get a better start and work out. Um, as, you, as you know, um, being a longtime Mattapan resident myself, um, sabe, along that corridor, there's a lot of ledge there, a lot of things to, um, to, to address as, as they embark upon this, um, this construction project. Al empezar este proyecto de construcción. Yeah. Are you able to answer the construction? What lane? Like, uh, Puede, I'm assuming that you don't eh, plan to start constructions on both sides. Um, qué carril de construcción va a empezar con el con cuál carril de construcción va a empezar porque imagino que no va a empezar en ambos carriles. No, we're working some plans out with BTD. I'm sorry, with um, no, estamos trabajando a trans con a transportation plan um, to eh, work along. We're not looking to we're not looking to take up both lanes at the same time. Um, just trying to coordinate so the traffic no, flows no and, and the work and proceed. Yeah. So we're still working that, that plan out. Okay. I appreciate yeah. that. And just to Entonces, be clear, sorry, just one more question. I think I saw it in Entonces, the chat, but I just wanted to más. be clear for everyone Creo que else. Lo vi en la chat, Are you planning to start claro this construction, planning to start at Woodrow? Which is like the cemetery that coming over the hill there from Woodrow? Woodrow was what have? Would have, sorry. Would have. Would have and Hobbit, yes. We're looking to start sí, working down. Es donde vamos a empezar. Okay. That's as we stand right now. That's, what we, that's as we stand right now. And I gave an April por date. Por ahora, that's at least a date that we're targeting with, that we're targeting with, but that's not abril, a hard line date. Pero no tenemos una fecha segura. Como dije, estamos like trabajando con, los, we're, we're eh, con las compañías de utilidades, de servicios. Okay. I appreciate that. So then that definitely La makes me reiterate eso. again the, the need for Entonces, signage. Me, si me permite, por favor, reiterar la necesidad well, para la you. señalización. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, sí. I, and I just want to Gracias. jump in quickly um, just to answer your questions about signage. Um, uh, we have a uh, abordar sus preguntas en cuanto a señalización. Uh, I, I was just going to mention Um, that Quisiera we have included in the contract um, que hemos incluido en el contrato. Um, changeable message, message signs um, as part of this project. Eh, so essentially the signs that I mean, indicate or highlight that I mean, there's construction going on or that I mean, a change um, in the traffic configuration is happening. Um, I eh, believe that we did that as part of the, the pilot. Que, eh, um, so that's something that, 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 that the contractor should be installing as part of this project eso as well. Parte del piloto, um, y regarding traffic signal, eh, eso Savannah and Rugby, we are looking at um, not specifically este the traffic también. signal, um, en but a, we are looking Savannah at rugby, potentially putting eh, an no RFB, which is es, a rectangle wrapper flash beacon, for pedestrians who need to cross if it's warranted in the future. Ultimately, we, we, we look at uh, warrants and whether eh, it is si required uh, at a location eh, and that, that cabo, directly has to go with, eh, you mean, the amount of cross traffic that's either coming in or out of the highway um, or, or out of the main street. Um, so 
as I mentioned, we will be looking o sea, at it. En Camino Sideway o saliendo a la calle principal. As, as now, y como a, mencioné, a, a es algo que vamos a estar right evaluando um, en el futuro. En este momento no vemos necesidad por ello. Pero, como Thank le mencioné, you. es algo en lo cual nos vamos a estar time, so I just want to make sure that we try to get um, to everyone's questions. Entonces, eh, sé que nos eh, um, falta we're, muy we're poco tiempo. Quiero asegurarme de que podamos contestar yeah. todas las preguntas. Um, Sheila. Sheila. Hi, thank you. Well, then, the, Gracias. I don't see it in the drawing. No a veo el traffic dibujo. light at that rotary. Un semáforo And en ese, en esa rotunda. Y si no hay diseño para un semáforo, You're tiene que haberlo. People's goodwill entering eh, si están, and maneuvering están esperando que la gente lo haga de su propia bondad. And they're coming in entrar from about al, a la four, possibly five directions. Viniendo de cuatro a cinco direcciones. So, en especial, alguien que quiere dar la vuelta. En un, gonna have entonces, sin un semáforo, chaos. va a ser caótico. Mm -hmm. Caos. Un lockdown de carros. So a traffic light has Entonces, to be put un semáforo there. debe instalarse. Now, you mentioned Mencionado. that you did the road traffic assessment six years ago. You began it in 2018. el tráfico de la calle hace seis años en el well, 2018. Well, that doesn't seem to be logical, given Eso that no the traffic lógico. pattern yeah. has las increased. Mm -hmm. han, eh, aumentado. This is now 24. Estamos en el 2024. And as it is, traffic backs up. Mm -hmm. Y el ya way, trying to get se to Mattapan Square, it Hasta backs Mattapan up Square. all the way si up to a Mattapan Square. And including the, se uh, the Hasta rugby area. Incluyendo el Now, area de rugby. you're going to put some bumps along the road. I imagine Entonces, these bumps are going to be si on the side streets. Resaltos, How imagino que van a estar las calles laterales. ¿Cómo se imagina huh. con chaos, el tráfico atascado? Caos en la rotunda. ¿Cómo envisionas a la gente que vive en esas calles laterales que pueda salir por Entonces, Esa gente que va a tener que bajarse por Blake Street para llegar a Mattapan. No tiene sentido. At all. And then when you Para talk nada. about two lanes, one lane, two cuando lanes de dos carriles, one, eh, and then you talk uno, about how the emergency vehicles are going to have to go. They're going to be riding on the sidewalks. De los, eh, how else are they going to when you have a backed up traffic? The emergency eh, vehicles are going to have to get up on the sidewalks. Because eh, it'll be van just, a tener que you talk about aceras. slowing down Porque es la única manera de tráfico. Be no Porque cuando hablan de disminuir el tráfico, el, el, la so, velocidad del tráfico, van a disminuir la velocidad del tráfico. Entonces la gente va a tener que viajar por Blake Street. Entonces, por favor, pongan Stop un semáforo en la rotunda. Eh, señales de paradas donde eh, las calles laterales inter inter interseccionan It's con dream. Coming Sideway. That was conceived, God knows when, you started in 2018. This is 2024 now, six years later. Your dream cannot stay the same year after year after year without su sueño no puede igual año tras año. the existing traffic pattern. Thank you. Dado Thank you. Las um, all right, so I'm going to try to run through your comments, um, your questions um, as quickly as possible. Um, Entonces voy a in regards, I'll, I'll, I'll so start back. In terms, so in regards to the, 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 the approaches onto Cummins Highway, there will be en stop signs a, on all those side streets approaching Cummins Highway. Um, cars will need to stop. Highway, they will have to stop according to the, the engineering design. Laterales. If they, they don't, they're going to damage their vehicles. Um, si if no they're driving at speeds that are vehicles. higher than, I mean, even 30 miles an hour. Like if they're no, driving no 30 miles an hour over the, the race cars, they're going to damage their vehicles. So that's definitely in the field infrastructure deterrent for for cars driving quickly into um, y eso es highway. un mecanismo no. en el tráfico para disminuir la velocidad. Vehicles, pero no van a dañar sus vehículos, I, I, van a dañar a I, gente. 
I, ideally, I'm, I'm trying to express that we're, we're trying to get cars to, to slow down. As you heard, there's a number of crashes along this corridor. We're trying to slow the vehicles down so that it's safer. Um, I, I also want to I mean, well, I, I also want to add that we had a pilot. We had a pilot implemented. Uh, for this project, you mean for, for over a year, where it was one lane in each direction, you mean vehicles, no, residents who lived on the side streets were able to get in and out of Cummins Highway, without, los, albeit, eh, you mean, we want all drivers to be driving slower on Cummins, Cummins, Cummins Highway through Cummins Highway. Um, this design si is actually a better, really, a better iteration eh, of the pilot. The pilot clearly eh, had, you mean, some flaws in regards to the The, the, we couldn't actually implement the design as, um, nos as it needed to be. Um, we we are looking at, um, we have looked at the traffic. And when I, when I, when I expressed that we looked at the traffic from 2018, that's when the traffic si was the worst on Cummins Highway because of the, the amount of vehicles eh, that were recorded using this fue, Since COVID, eh, the, the, Since COVID, when COVID tráfico, first hit, the, the, the volume of traffic plummeted, um, and it's steadily increased over the years, absolutely. Um, I, I believe the last time we checked, años, which was um, this year, um, in, or, or, or late last year in regards to the traffic that was on pasado, Cummins Highway, it still has not reached the peak highway, no traffic volume that were on Cummins pico. Highway when we took the, the, the traffic counts in 2018. So all, that, all I'm saying is that we use the most drastic Entonces, um, lo que le decir traffic es que information in regards to Cummins eh, Highway in order to design de tráfico um, para to, to, ese to, to slow vehicles down. So like we, we, we took into account that capacity and how it would, be, it would be able to function on Cummins Highway. So if there's less cars, highway. it'll, it'll work even Entonces, better. Si Um, and as I mentioned, like, we, we understand the, the traffic approach and coming to, um, approaching Madison Square as part of um, the design, and, and, and it, it does back up. We, we understand that, and we've been out there. We've saw, we've seen it, um, which is why we're looking at, but which is why we're, we're maintaining those two lanes um, that are entering the Madison Highway um, was, um, eastbound. eastbound, eastbound into Madison eh, Square este. when the, the BTD. The BTD uh, Mattapan Square Cuando project is actually BTD completed and implemented. Project, it will allow for more traffic to flow out of Cummins eh, Highway so that Cummins Highway isn't back, so that it isn't más dealing with those, um, those congestion issues that, that happen in the peak. So that, that is something that we're going to continue to work on. That being said, we can't wait until the, the BTD Dicho project no is completed to make Cummins Highway safe. We, we have the budget, we have the design, um, which is why we eh, want to move forward, and, and a lot of those things will come after. So we, we are looking at um, progressing in regards to making it to improving safety on this corridor, um, which is We'll then look at you mean traffic signals, Pero crossing signals if those are needed. Um, that is something that we will, we will be evaluating. Eh, But um, as I mentioned, like, we, we have the, we, we've done the pilot. The pilot was Pero technically, in, in terms of the design, a lot worse than y, what y we're proposing piloto, because the, the, era the, median, the median was, was an impediment for vehicles eh, being planeando. able to, to maneuver around Cummins Highway. The median is going to be gone as part of the project, so we will allow traffic to flow at a more efficiently, um, but that be a safer way. Eso permite que se haga más eficientemente, pero de una manera más segura. traffic light at the rotary? Oh, yeah, en sorry. La um, ah, we also perdón, looked at that. Sí. We also looked at a traffic light. También nos light, fijamos um, en eso. What we ultimately un, determined un semáforo. was that... Pero al final um, lo que determinamos... Because of the traffic that is coming out of Way Boston Street. Es, the traffic that is coming out of Alabama Street, 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 which is essentially a, a, a private way. Um, que es a es of, una calle privada. Actually access the road coming in and out. Y son um, pocos and the number of traffic that comes out of Greenfield Road way. A lot of the times, the traffic at that intersection would be Muchas veces el um, en esa intersección for Cummins Highway would be green. So then you would still continue para, having vehicles speeding va, through va this verde. intersection. Um, Entonces, I mean, eh, así tendrá vehículos eh, pasando um, a alta velocidad. We, we envisioned or we looked at the design of what would be more safer for pedestrians, for, for cyclists, lo que nos fijamos um, el diseño, era solo for drivers, para los peatones, para los ciclistas, para los conductores. Uh, we do have examples of roundabouts throughout the city of Boston. One, one in particular Tenemos I can mention uh, is in Highland Square in Boston. Jamaica Plain. Um, Por ejemplo, el de, it, it, eh, High School in Jamaica Plain. It's... it's 
easy to function through. I mean, to be honest, um, donde, eh, I, I deal with the vehicles eh, that are traveling from along Cummins Highway. Los be able to, que están to, por Cummins for the highway. most part, travel on Cummins Highway um, por su mayor parte in a, 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 a more por Cummins efficient highway. manner. Um, en una manera eficiente. When entering this roundabout, I mean, the are you going to enter this route? I mean, let's just put it in contra de un semáforo. You don't have to go to, you know, too much. You need a traffic. Well, no if you don't put it there now, mucho. you will eventually. Pero si no lo hacen ahora, lo van a hacer. I mean, it, it's, it's eventually. something that we evaluated and and we sí, um, based on evaluamos. engineering, uh, we we chose to go en base with, uh, a la roundabout. Ingeniería. To help y elegimos and slow down eh, quedarnos con eh, la velocidad para mejorar if you have eh, a traffic light. y para disminuir la velocidad de los coches. Sí, no. la rotunda está bien si joke, tiene un semáforo. Eh, like, perdón, um, eh, disculpe que lo interrumpo, pero ¿quién es, ¿quién es nosotros? Porque se escucha como que los ciudadanos Me, encima I, tienen I, un I, voto. I'm, I don't know if you said Sheila or someone else, but I had my hand raised and I didn't get a voice in my opinion yet. So I don't know if it's Sheila Burke or Sheila someone, the other lady spoke her piece and now this one's interrupting. I would just like to ask a question to get an answer to. Th 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 thank you, Sheila. Oh, um, I don't, I don't know if she's next in the queue, but I mean, you are, you already have the the floor, so please, please proceed. Yeah, yeah someone mentioned no sé si that sigue, um, they would like English. Si other, um, mencionó another language as a second language for people that don't speak English. How would they be no able inglés. to get around on American Legion Highway or whatever? ¿Cómo pueden transitar But por American Legion Highway? There are 35 languages. Pero hay 35 idiomas. Offer for the driver's exam now. How would that be implemented? En el cual se ofrece el examen para right el now we have conductores. Start, ¿Cómo se van a implementar? Proceed with cautious. So, if they don't en este understand that, eh, how would seguir, 35 languages be put up? Si no entienden eso, so ¿cómo se van a poner 35 idiomas para que la gente pueda entender en su propio idioma? There was a, um, the host, she had said that they were going to put signs up. Creo que alguien yeah. dijo que, que la presentadora dijo que Hannah, van a poner señalización. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. so la thanks for the suggestion. Um, sí, gracias por la sugerencia. This is definitely something that we can, um, eso es algo que definitivamente Add, um, podemos using agregar our temporary signs when the construction is completed. I think you're asking about that. Que, Some que sort of signage está, um, that provides señalización um, que so the typical way of fighting. So they can understand that you go right or left. Para But que I'm puedan entender que sí que van a la derecha o a la izquierda. Now, for the driver's exam. Pero lo que estoy diciendo es que hay 35 idiomas que están en este momento. Para, o tiene cinco idiomas para la prueba, la expresión, el examen de eh, el carnet well, de um, maybe you conducir. Can chat me, um, ¿Cómo vamos a abordar more todos sus idiomas? Specific questions, but eh, as a city, um, we do have a couple set of eh, yeah, eh, preguntas. Um, si so una pregunta as a city, we're going to put signs up, and I'm like, Wondering how do you get 35 van a poner languages in signs put up around that area that's being built. So, so I, I, I don't mean to um, interject, but um, in, in regards okay, to perdón, the, the traffic por, signs along the corridor, um, which the traffic signs that are mandated corredor, by the city, in terms of um, um, the being standing for being standards by the state, what is the traffic signs that are mandated in terms of being standards by the state, those are the ones en that, los will del the estado, that will be installing as part of the project, will essentially be, be arrows to kind of direct people where to go um, in the roundabout, yield signs, a, a uh, crosswalk signs, pedestrian crosswalk signns, I mean, no eh, left on, no on the left signs. Those are all de, standard signs eh, that the city of Boston uses, and we will, son, we will be implementing as part of this project. I believe what Hannah is referring to is additional signage that Creo we will be posting along the corridor um, that aren't traffic signs um, no to provide people with more information how to use um, the corridor um, or be able to reach out to, to the city if they have any questions. That, that en en cuanto a cómo utilizar el corredor y cómo alcanzar I think that's what I was asking. Is that correct? 
How do, how are you going to put up 35 languages for people that's driving, that do not understand English, or do not read English? How would you put up all those signs? Would it be in a light that's flashing? Going from one language to another, or what? No, uh, no, we, no. Go ahead, go ahead, Anna. Yeah, I was just gonna add that they, we have um cardboard signs, and I can I can chat with you after this and definitely show you an example of what we've installed across the city. Um, just because there's a couple other people in the queue, I want to um Pero dado que hay, eh, ask a question. Más I'm going to um, oh, you answer my question. So thank you. And that was welcome. the well, other question that, question that I had. One was already answered in the tengo, chat, and now you answered this one. So thank you. Um, Shirley, I'm going to ask you to unmute. Shirley, le voy a permitir, le voy a Pedir que por favor active su micrófono. Hello. Can you hear Hola. me? Yes. ¿Me puede escuchar? Okay. Yes. Sí. Uh, my name is Shirley Carrington. I Mi am a 44 year resident Carrington. of Wood Avenue. So Wood Avenue de 44 is already años de Wood Avenue. very, very problematic in terms of Wood traffic ya and crashes and accidents and deaths. So Choques I'm concerned y about y muertes. all of that Entonces, traffic. A mí me preocupa is probably detours anyway. Tráfico, but when the construction starts, I think we're going to see an desvios, increase in traffic coming down Wood Avenue. So I'm concerned about air qualities, the traffic so being lined up, the cars aire, el tráfico um, que se va atascar, putting out all kinds of fumes. And I am just concerned about the increased humo. traffic Entonces, as people detour because they're going to get to Wood Ave and comments and they're going to take an immediate right to avoid traffic, a, a, all the traffic the problems problem that we're come, going to encounter come, come as this construction begins. So that's my concern. Tráfico. Any thought given to anything that could happen regarding es that detour? Oh. So um, as part of this project, we're not closing the roadway for, no for traffic. Um, I understand that you know, there may be some drivers or individuals who may Entiendo choose to use cut, cut, cut through streets, um, like I me mean, would have, you know, which is what, something that we've kind of heard about um, as part of the pilot. Um, but I mean, when it comes to construction, it, it's, it's disruptive. We, we, we understand that. We understand people are going to try to avoid it. Um, um, in, in regards to um, the, the safety along the corner, um, or on the side streets, um, that, that, as I mentioned, like, that's something that we are looking at addressing, I mean, in the future, um, as part of this project, the neighborhood, in the, neighborhood um, the safety search program, which will be installing speed humps Con along um, search, um, the, the side instalar. streets, that's something that, 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 that will probably laterales. be occurring um, simultaneously with the Cummins Highway project. I, I don't know what actual date start date in, for when they're going to be um, implementing those speed humps, but... Um, the city, I mean, we're also um, working on looking at what have um, for the future as well. But, I mean, it, it's, it's construction is something destructive. We understand that. Um, it, it is also te temporary. Um, I mean, whether it be two years or um, um, we, we are, we, we ultimately, we, we need to take the time to So we just ask for with us. If there's any issues, please let us know. Please reach out to us. Um, and we'll try to address it um, as, as best as we can si um, in terms of that traffic or saber, if any issues eh, arise. Uh, we, talk, we talked about the air quality. We had a mile on Cummins Highway. Eh, um, I believe maybe during the pilot, eh, um, we looked at the air quality aire, um, along the corridor. Eh, it wasn't eh, I mean, any different from other, eh, other areas in Boston. Aire, calidad, um, we're going to continue eh, monitoring to that, but um, no in terms of the air quality, I mean, it's, it's my understanding it was not an issue. It's not an issue at this time. But, um, but yeah, no just ask me a patient service construction because we know eh, it's going to be disruptive. We just want to, people to be informed. Um, we want pe people to be updated about what's going on um, so eh, that I mean, they are taking the time they are ready, um, 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 taking the additional time that they may need to, they may need to take um, because of um, construction, um, congestion, or traffic that may result from it. So um, we just, just ask for your patience, to be honest. Thank you. Thank you, Gisela. Gracias. Gisela? Hi. Thank you so much for going into Hola. detail um, eh, gracias por los detalles. about our questions. So I have a question about the, um, just put it in the chat, 
the uh, rotary at the Sunoco gas station. I'm looking at the rendering um, that I just put in the chat and where is the entrance to the Sunoco gas station because the, um, the idea of the rotary is for traffic to flow. Um, es and que el tráfico so fluya. Pulse, first, I, I like to know Entonces, where would the entrance be, and also pues how dónde está esa entrada. sudden y cómo, slowness and or stop, if you will, that, of that turn y cómo la uh, is going to be handled. So, for example, as I'm driving, I'm in the rotary, and I'm driving, um, and I want to go over to the central si gas station. I'm going to significantly in the rotary while well, I'm in the rotary. I'm going to significantly slow down and then make a turn. Um, and there's going to be traffic behind me. So two questions: um, Where's the entrance of the gas station, and then how is the service? You know, uh, a spe uh, uh, the speeding going to be handled when somebody wants, when a driver wants to pull this into the Sunoco gas station. Thank you. So, the Sunoco gas station entrances, um, for the most part, um, actually, they're being maintained. Está, um, so, the entrance that there is that there is on Greenfield, the entrance that's está on um, in Greenfield. Cummins Highway, the two entrances that are Cummins, Cummins Highway, Highway. Um, the curb. The curb, um, curb cuts for for driveways, those are going to be maintained. Eh, um, las, ideally, las rampas, if you're eh, traveling los bordillos, um, se va a eastbound um, on Cummins si Highway, which is pretty much from este, Wood Ave, and you're you're, you're driving Cummins towards Highway, Mattapan Square, um, you can si either enter off of Greenfield Road. Um, so tiene, same way you would do um, now, Road, you would turn onto Greenfield Road and turn, into the, the, turn left ahora, into the gas station, ahora, eh, um, or you can Road continue going through the, order, the rotary, o traveling eastbound, and turn right into la, um, la the Sunoco gas station, um, y, which you, which you can't do. Uh, what we are changing lo que no um, puede is lo que we're building a median. So if you're coming out of the Sunoco gas station um, que si está from Cummins de Highway, Sonoco, you won't be able to take a left. Highway. So you'd have no to continue going down que um, Cummins Highway eastbound Cummins towards Highway. Mattapan Square. If you're, if you're trying to Hacia come out of Sunoco Mattapan gas Square. station, um, turn it on to Cummins. We've had a conversation with the Sunoco gas station owner about their operations. What they're eventually going to be doing is they're going to be driving eastbound on Cummins Highway, turning into um, Sunoco, and then um, pumping in their gas like they normally do, what they usually do, um, and then come out on Greenfield and go around the roundabout to continue westbound. Um, they looked at it. We, we did the, the turning movements um, regarding their tankers, um, and it works. So that, that's that's ultimately what, what, what we kind of chose to do. Um, for that design. Like the roundabout being mountables and must. For their, for their, um, for their Thank you. I appreciate that. It's just with the rendering, I don't because I see the side um, the raised or whatever side uh, sidewalk, and then. Uh, green the the red red I, I could probably I, I mean I could probably share share my screen just show quickly but I mean if, if anything we can I can send you if you can share a screen that would be great as you speak that would be nice thank you yeah 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 right. uh, share. okay um so this is the the traffic payment Esto. marking plan um for the plan de As you can see, this is all the signage that's showing which direction you should be traveling. It's going to be surrounded in, in this, um, um, in this um, elevated um, island area. Um, but if you're traveling down, Cummins, isla, you, you're driving into the roundabout, si you can either Cummins. turn on to Greenfield and take a left Entrando in, la rotunda, or you can continue driving on Cummins and take a right in, después, either here eh, or a la here. Izquierda, if you're coming out, you have to take a right in both of these entrances. Pero si está saliendo, um, tiene so that is something that we're changing. We did provide a median de here um, as an approach to Eso the roundabout as cambiando. well um, to not have cars turning in and out ahead of the, eh, the roundabout to kind of keep traffic flowing dentro, eh, perdón, en frente al tráfico. So, que está sorry, Jeff, uh, Nathaniel Fink here with uh, BTD. Eh, perdón, if you eh, are Jeff going Nathaniel to go Fink here con westbound el on Cummins, si usted está you can a exit onto Greenfield Street. Puede salir so even though there's a median there Street. that makes it Entonces, so that you can only turn right onto Cummins, 
from the entrance on Cummins, you can go on to Greenfield Street and do the roundabout and then make a left on Cummins to continue west. Just want to add that in case anyone is concerned about that. Uh, the gas station will still be accessible from all directions. That's really sad because Greenfield Road already Eso es muy triste would be congested Road, trying to get in front to come in highway. God bless the people who are trying to get into the gasoline station Thank you. I'm going to move on to other questions in the queue. Um, Pamela? Voy a pasar a otra gente. Hi, es I have two questions. Um, I wanted to touch Tengo on the rotary again, and I just want to um, advocate support for either there being a crossing signal, if not a traffic abogar, light. Eh, it definitely needs to be some sort of crossing signal at that rotary or some sort of beacon um, that you guys discussed before. Um, I think it's very dangerous. I do not like the traffic Creo six rotary in Hyde Square. I do not like it no when it comes to crossing that rotary. So I am advocating that we have no me gusta some sort of esa other rotunda. signal there. If Entonces, it's not a traffic light, um, it, it's si no possibly a beacon or just a crossing signal algún, that pedestrians could press to cross the road. Secondly, can you please eh, identify for, puedan, for me eh, what you consider to be a beacon? You said that coming out of the gas station, you would only be able to take a right to go west, I think you said, towards Mattapan. What is going to be there to... Um, to encourage people ahí from ahí taking a left turn. Para que la gente no pueda doblar uh, la izquierda. Uh, Yes, thank, thank you, Pamela. Um, we we Gracias, working Pamela. we're working with our design consultant in regards to um, the need for traffic de, de signal or RFB um, approaching the the roundabout. Um, I, I understand your concern. Gráfico, um, I mean, we 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 are allowing um, what we are proposing for, for the roundabout. Um, lo que estamos proponiendo approaches. para la I mean, it's, it's it's a uh, engineering design that 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 takes a look at um, improving spaces for pedestrians final, and where they should cross, which is, is outside of the, on the, the roundabout, um, the crossing distances are, are, are shortened where um, fuera de la rotunda, on one, la one para approach, es más corta. I mean, it's, it's 11 foot wide, um, it's a little foot wide, wide um, de, eh, un ancho de travel lane, pies. and from there you cross and there's a, 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 a small area cruza. where you can um, you can um, wait for vehicles to, to pass. Technically, cars pasen. should be stopping um, before you, eh, before, um, while parar. you're in the crosswalk. But um, we're, we're looking at it. We're, we're seeing what we can do. As I mentioned, we are estamos, looking at it. Eh, um, para ver lo que for this, this project as needed. Um, eh, para hacer cualquier mejora que in se regards to um, people taking a left out of en a la gente, gas station eh, la onto Cummins Highway to drive westbound. Um, para there will be a median a la, a la um, oeste. in between the two Habrá travel lanes. So they won't be, uh, they won't be able to, to take a left on the Cummins Highway. Entonces, if they take a left no on the Cummins Highway, doblar they're doblar going to be driving on the, road, the wrong side of the road. Um, so that, si that's no ultimately... So, so there's going to be like concrete there? Traffic. Some sort of yes. concrete? Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. All right. Yes. Okay. Sí. Thank you. Sí. Concreto. Sí, absolutamente. Gracias. All right. And Fatima. Thank you for your presentation. Um, Gracias por su presentación. I, I put an question in the chat about you had a, una pregunta um, rápida que la entré en la caja de chat en cuanto a una reunión que tuvieron el 2022 en cuanto a discapacidades. ¿Hay un enlace al reporte o algo que surgió de eso? No lo vi. Algo que pudiéramos compartir para tener mejor entendimiento de lo que se habló específicamente para abordar, porque tenemos mucha gente, no sé si es alto o bajo, pero he visto mucha gente con eh, sillas de ruedas eh, electrónicas motorizadas viajando por Camensab, pero no creo que haya visto eh, algo específico o una recomendación específica. No he visto eh, eh, nada en las reuniones en las cuales eh, yo he asistido. Entonces, eh, quiero saber si hay algún reporte, alguna grabación de esa eh, reunión. 
Yes. So Jen just um, linked that meeting sí. recording Jen in the chat. Acaba de poner and ese enlace en la caja de chat. Y para todos um, esto es una reunión que se hizo to about en 2022 how we look the different aspects that we look into when we um, try to design the street to be safer. En cuanto a diseñar um, esta so calle para que sea más segura. Uno de los eh, so race crosswalks are flat. Their side, they are es, eh, um, even elevar from sidewalk los, to sidewalk, eh, so it's like a curb standard curb eh, ramp, which could develop Entonces, more en vez de una issues rampa cortada, and cause que puede, um, eh, problemas, uh, issues for people using mobility devices, Para the race crosswalk, um, which we've been seeing across the city, is el, el generally more comfortable que for people por la ciudad, who are in wheelchairs or using canes or other devices. Para la gente en, eh, um, silla rueda, I'm Jeff, do you have otros, anything other to add about our Jeff, tiene, tiene how we integrate AE into design? In terms of how we introduce this compliment with accessibility in the design. I'll few words. Um, ultimately, um, eh, the Disabilities Commission um, and, and the Representatives have been involved um, in the development of, of this project and its design. Um, so han sido involucrados. Um, I mean, they, they're, they're part of the, the Public Improvement Commission. We need their approval in order to move forward eh, with any of our projects. Um, ultimately, we, we take their guidance um, in regards to how we design our streets um, for people Entonces, with disabilities, eh, people with elderly eh, as well. Um, Sus, Ultimately, eh, not only do we want to meet, you mean ADA, ADA standards, um, AAB, um, standards and guidelines, but you mean, our disability y, commission y has los you mean, eh, de, even, eh, even more extensive um, guidelines that we that we want to maintain um, y, and eh, adhere to as part of this project. Um, eh, one of them, like I think one of the things I can mention is that you mean, they, they make sure that we provide um, a minimum of five feet clearance. Um, on our sidewalks or any spaces um, where, where pedestrians are walking. So that, that is something that we need to look at um, providing all throughout um, coming to our way on the sidewalks um, and areas where you know, there may be some parking or even areas where there may be green infrastructure, we are looking at providing um, spaces that you know, provide access for people who may have disabilities. Entonces, si alguien tiene discapacidades o una persona eh, o cuida a una persona con discapacidades, eh, ¿a quién pueden contactar si hay problemas? Um, yeah, I mean, they, they can reach out to the Disabilities Commission in regards to this project. Sí, pueden um, if they run into con issues, they can de contact me because we, we are still in, este proyecto, um, um, in the construction process. Conmigo, um, so if there's something that, 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 that needs to be flagged, Entonces, si hay algo que se tenga que eh, destacar, es algo que queremos efectivamente saber so, para ver lo que podemos hey, um, hacer. Con nuestra ah, quisiera decir también, si usted Boston, eh, tiene algún problema en general en su área de Boston, project, no uh, específico al proyecto de Collins Highway, is your best lo puede reportar al 311. Eso es la so mejor for, manera de resolver uh, this project, los problemas. Obviously, Entonces, para este proyecto, obviamente si hay cosas que surgen durante um, la construcción o el diseño, that, la gente again, de la ciudad en esta llamada son los que, los cuales, eh, son los que deberían de comunicarse. Pero en general, el 311. Creo que esto es más allá de eso. Entonces voy a ponerme en contacto con Jeff. All right, Gracias. and then Vicky. Vicky. Yes, hi. Thank you very Gracias. much for allowing me to speak again. Por permitir, um, permitirme, permitirme hablar otra one vez. of the things that listening to everyone um, eh, una cosa is that, escuchar a todos, you know, we, it could be es que beneficial for us ser to have um, wherever the que tengamos crosswalks are donde están los cruces peatonales to push the button to donde say la gente tiene la oportunidad de oprimir el botón para indicarles and que es hora de cruzar is a learning tool for y es una herramienta de aprendizaje maybe have a different language aún para la gente que tal vez hable eh, otro idioma and that Eso es para indicarles um, que es el momento que pueden drivers eh, know cruzar. 
they can't y drive. Para alertar a los conductores que no I pueden manejar. I know on Morton Street. They, Just like in Morton Street. There's a left that cambian. used to be able to take. Ah, antes, and anteriormente se podía doblar la izquierda. Harvard Street y ahora tienen que seguir hasta Harvard Street. The first street in order to y llegar a la primera calle. To, para poder to, volver. Um, Morton Street. A Morton Street. Um, and I'm pretty sure that that's destructive. Y estoy it's, segura you know, que eso es challenging for the people who live on that street. Es desafioso para la gente que vive en esa But calle. But again, someone said something Pero, about, nuevo, como alguien dijo, you know, signage. En cuanto and a la señalización. Making sure that that information is y asegurarnos given que esa información prior to se entrega all the construction antes that's going de toda la construcción que va a estar That's sucediendo. Important. Eso es importante. Having, you going, and then realize, oh, de llegar I can't donde piensa way. que va a llegar y darse cuenta que no puede viajar That's por ahí. Eh, eso and no es justo. It's kind of time consuming if you're trying to pick up your child or whatever. Toma mucho tiempo or si tiene que ir a recoger a su niño o cualquier matter. cosa. No, no But importa. It would be Um, be better, Pero sería and mejor. maybe people wouldn't feel so frustrated and annoyed no se tan frustrada. if they have this information ahead of time. Si esa and I don't mean antes de when tiempo. they get where they're supposed to turn. I mean, y no, no two me blocks away. A a so ponerle, a darle esa información en el momento oh, que I tienen que doblar, sino way. antes, unas and dos cuadras antes, para que se Put the information out there Entonces, lo que está diciendo, before lo reitero, construction. Da, entregar esa información um, antes de la construcción. Let me take myself a little bit off of... Um, I'm here, so just, ya, I just ya, wanted voy a to parar. share that. Because eh, estoy aquí, it solamente is, quise um, compartir eso. It, 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 I'm, it, it's good that we're all here speaking es this. Es bueno que todos estamos aquí hablando de esto. To, um, es una buena manera others. para informar a otros. Who are, you know, in the community, who's driving, que están en la comunidad. biking and walking. Los que están manejando, ciclando, so, caminando. Sorry, I just want to ask a quick sí, question. Kate. Is the city looking to Una implement different languages for signage across the city and la not just in Madison? Because that seems that I've taken up about a good hour in this conversation. So I'm just curious ciudad. to know, is that a plan for the city to take oh, signage and driving and street esta, signs and all these good stuff across proyecto. the entire city of Boston? Entonces, este es un plan is that a plan that you all are aware of? Es poner that I'm not? Más en toda la de no, en las, en um, there is isn't a citywide plan. No. Um, what I had no mentioned is that as part of street design, when, um, es como parte de, de, eh, when we implement new street designs, we sometimes install temporary signage. Tenemos que implementar Eh, cardboard signs they they stay up on street for a very long time de um, and that with que se por mucho we tiempo, have the flexibility to y que have la messages to help people adjust to the new configuration de, and to eh, cambiar um, el mensaje para que la gente pueda ajustar share more messages yeah so that's what I was referencing y compartir más okay. mensajes es a eso que me, me estaba refiriendo ah, muchas gracias solo curiosa gracias eh, ¿Puedo yeah, hacer yes, un comentario please. o no? Sí, oh, gracias. I was happy to hear you. So, Siempre so feliz de escucharlo. To, la intersección uh, a la cual Vicky se refiere um, I, I heard that, y you know, the eh, question about 35 de la cual Kenya se refiere, um, escuché languages. la pregunta de, los, de las 35 idiomas. Traffic signs. Is there a, eh, lo que a hacemos con la civilización that, uh, that really es que hay una, una señal universal que Ireland comunica Italy, or or en todos los idiomas, esté en Italia o en Francia o en los Estados Unidos. Hay cosas que, que se comunican the, universalmente. The so, yes, I think, to Kenya's point, y I think, let's not la señalización se basa en eso. Entonces, eh, hablando de lo que dijo Kenia, and, no nos vamos a comprometer a los 35 idiomas en todo, so en todo los, eh, that, uh, los carteles. Eso no es algo que vayamos a hacer. Right eh, moment, lo que um, se va a hacer en esta intersección en particular, eso se comunicó de la mejor manera que pudimos 
a la but, gente que está cerca uh, de esta you never tell everyone. No one is going to ever always be in Pero, one of these meetings to know that we're about to make these changes. And so the Cortland Street que, lab that we eliminated eh, was one of the most dangerous labs no in, todos están en esa all of New England, saber. literally, in all el of Cortland New England. Que se and so it is much safer to go down to Harvard. Más and en yes, Inglaterra. we tried our best eh, to clean people. Eh, that eh, in advance, but there's no way we got to the entire community. So we hope that Obviously, y intentamos the todo lo que pudimos para comunicar esto por adelantado, uh, eh, pero estoy segura okay que esto es seguro que no llegamos a la, la comunidad entera. entera. Hay unos 27, 26, 27 dólares en Court Street. I hope that's what she was saying. Is there? I, I couldn't figure out what you said. You want one of those buttons, Vicky. or we saying you didn't want one of those buttons? Um, eh, that, no sé si indicó que quiere uno de esos botones o que no lo quiere para cruzar en la discusión. Eso es lo que dijo Vicky. Entonces, lo que le puedo decir es que la gente ha mejorado llegar a Harvard en vez de hablar ilegalmente a la izquierda en Cortland Street. Porque se han dado cuenta con el tiempo With the light que es giving you mucho a, más a seguro doblar la izquierda con el semáforo y no intentar eh, cruzar yes. rápidamente I'm, y provocar un I'm choque. Not complaining. Sí, I'm y not no me estoy quejando. No estoy diciendo nada. Lo que estoy diciendo it, es que no me había dado cuenta. Y cuando me di cuenta, it, por fin, I estaba my bien. Creo que mi preocupación era que te, tenía que tomar to to la izquierda Morton, to para get volver a Morton, Portland, para llegar a Portland. It's fine. It's all fine. Que está bien. Está bien. What it was is that Lo que era, we didn't, I didn't know it. es que no sabía. That's just my own personal es, thing. But I but think, I think your big point is if we can tell them in Pero advance, that's que, what you're saying. El punto que quiere, quiere hacer es que le tenemos que avisar por adelantado. Para la gente que va a estar ahí, yeah. I mean, you know, para que sepan, we're on the same page. con adelanto. Sí, 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 the, sí. Creo que el punto que estamos intentando es eh, You have this comunicarse el mismo. Um, this the signs that say desafortunadamente you know, there's a pedestrian signs and people are still peatones. y la gente aún not understanding that you can you have to stop no entiende que usted tiene que parar I saw he visto the car on the right stop un coche a, en la and derecha this person parar. is getting ready to cross the y la persona está preparándose para cruzar and I was holding my peatonal. breath because y I could not, paré de respirar I didn't know if the car, porque no sabía the car on the left was si el coche a la izquierda iba so a seguir. To me, that felt Entonces, like a mí, this person es, know sentí que esa persona no sabe las normas de la And calle. Y, y eso da miedo. And then you still have people y luego aún tiene gente who are taking the left onto Cortland que está Even doblando a la izquierda says, de Portland, aunque la, you can't do eh, la señal dice que no se That's puede hacer. Eso es lo único que so estoy diciendo. No sé, and, lo veo um, a menudo. You know, my, I'm not It's not y no voy a disculparme. No es algo que alguien ha, works, haya hecho mal. If you, if you follow the rules. Pero creo que funciona si that's cumplen con las normas. And, uh, Eso es lo que know, siento. And, and that's why I said, you know, y es por eso that if we, que espero you know, have good signage, que si that people will tenemos see buena señalización, before buenos carteles, que la gente lo vaya a ver coming antes highway, de Coming Highway. Reconstruction happens. Antes que la reconstrucción so empiece. To understand para que la gente empiece a entender do what you used to do. que no puede hacer lo que antes hacía. I hope that makes some sense. No sé yes. si eso tiene lógica. Ab absolutely. Sí, that, that, that sí absolutamente. Um, yeah, gracias, one, more, one more response, not so much to Vicky, but yeah, yeah, go ahead. I, sí, think una, I think after, una after COVID, respuesta más I, I no, no a Vicky en sí. Después de COVID, 
folks almost treat it as though it's a suggestion, eh, eh, not a rule. En cuanto a And los carteles y los semáforos en rojo, yo creo que la gente lo está tratando como now, sugerencia. Now, light go por lo que he visto. Red lights blow at you when you just come to a police stop. Ah, It's almost like a suggestion at this point. Sigue we'll be doing it loud and clear. por los semáforos en rojo. Thank you. Como si fuera so una sugerencia. Entonces, le escuchamos eh, claramente, Becky. Thank you, Becky. Gracias. Gracias, Gracias por siempre um, estar aquí yeah, con I, nosotros. I just want to add, um, I, I, Gracias, I mean, I think eh, that was the last question. Eh, Solo quisiera agregar con esa última pregunta. Que creo que esa fue la última pregunta. Um, um, eh, estamos a 30 minutos más signs, adicionales um, de tiempo eh, we'll inicial with, que íbamos a cerrar. Um, eh, quisiera agregar que eh, la señalización y la organización de construcción con la cual estamos trabajando la contratista, estamos desarrollando un plan para manejar la construcción. Um, y change, diseñando eh, signs, trabajando con the, nuestro consultante um, de diseño the electronic signs so that you can you mean program eh, you mean some para language or term you mean to inform eh, residents drivers that puede you mean, the, the, the traffic configuration is changing um, eh, los que signs along the roadway to say that you mean there's, there's road work in hand or, or, de um, de work zone like all that information la calle is technically should be provided along the highway approaching the highway um, as part of the construction um, I, I, I know we um, initially requested for um, a, chan a changeable message Creo sign pedi to be installed at the um, American Legion Highway intersection, que se um, approaching Cummins Highway en um, Legion as well highway as um, another one highway. that's Um, Así como otra, around, um, Mattapan eh, aproximadamente Square. en so, Mattapan Square. Folks driving, entering the work zone, para um, que la gente eh, manejando por entrando en zona de trabajo possibly durante after la construcción. When construction is completed, to a certain extent, eh, we just want to uh, la inform la drivers después, that there's a new traffic configuration para along Cummins Highway de una so that they're aware if they're not familiar highway. with this new para traffic estén, configuration, they need to drive slower, they need to drive safer. Si no, Eh, so that they can get used to it and understand what the new street layout is and the configuration will be. So that is something that we, we have included as part of the traffic management plan. As I mentioned, construction, man oh, as construction man del, management eh, has mentioned that's still in the process and they're still working on that. Yes, we, we understand April is coming eh, very soon. So we, we will be providing um, um, that information eh, to the community. Please eh, sign up for the, for, the, for the updates because um, I mean, that's, that's ideally the, the primary um, favor, eh, avenue that we're going to be using to reach out to and provide um, ser, eh, information to the community. So en, please en sign la, up for those. We'll get those out to you. Um, we'll get any, so uh, any information out to you. Vicky, we're going to reach out in regards to your business. Y um, Vicky, por supuesto que nos vamos a comunicar en cuanto a su comercio. Pero um, parece que van a pasar bien mucho más. Um, as of April, um, Entonces, we'll, tal vez no tenga we'll preocupaciones um, eh, en abril, pero vamos know, a estar Hannah, do you want to kind of jump in and, and close this out? Hannah, quiere, yeah, eh, thank you, everyone. Um, eh, seguir para just mindful of time, cerrar and todo. I just wanted to point everyone Gracias a todos, to um, quiero the ser consciente email tiempo address de la hora. that you can send concerns Acá or questions. Nuestro correo electrónico para que pueda compartir preocupaciones o preguntas. Hay también otras preguntas que queremos questions. contestar. But también vamos a mandarles so much, la grabación de esta presentación um, para ver si eso también conteste algunas de preguntas. Gracias a todos por unirse y por compartir sus preguntas. Eh, todo se va a tomar en cuenta y apreciamos sus yeah. comentarios. Thanks, everyone. Have a great Thank night. You. Thank you. Thank you. Good night. Thank you. Good night. Good night. Good night.